Hello, 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 everybody. Good to see everybody tonight. Oh, I had a completely different show ready for you guys. And then this happened tonight. So, <laughs> uh, we'll talk about it all here in a second. How's everybody doing tonight? It's great to see everybody. Uh, Tones overthinks it. Uh, member for three months says, Chili is sad. Josh took the coke and the divorce. <laughs> We'll talk about that. That's pretty funny to me. It's pretty funny to me. And he, no, in fact, we won't be talking about it tonight because Chili will be doing all the talking. He went live with, uh, let me, uh, <laughs> give me one second. Let me tell you the title of his video. Snake in the Grass. Uh, so apparently today was, uh, Chili took Kate to court. Kate from the Massel Report. And I don't know all the details. I have spoken briefly with Kate. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have since I don't have the ins and outs of the court case. I'm not going to speculate about any of it except for what Chili says in his video tonight. But we're going to be watching his video. We're also going to be having a small laugh at the whole thing because it's pretty damn funny. It's funny if you ask me. You know, maybe it's not funny to everybody else, but it's funny if you ask me. And. Uh, uh, yeah, he got seriously butthurt tonight by Josh Abrams. I believe Josh Abrams. I don't want to, again, make any assumptions. Josh Abrams was uh, the guy that he was there at the um, court, was supposed to be his, the guy that was had his back and everything in this case. And I think he ended up testifying for Kate. <laughs> Ah, so let's talk about it. All right, so tonight we're going to watch that video. It's just going to be me solo. Uh, if Brainy Beaver happens to jump in, I'll let Brainy in. If uh, if anybody else wants to come in, you just let me know, and I'll I'll, I'll consider it. Uh, I'm not not gonna for sure let just anybody on, but you know, Tones Tones, I see you out there. If you want to jump on, you're cool. Uh, Kate probably had to de debuse herself from Chili from the Age of Fabulous. Thank you very much. All right, we'll give a few people um, a chance to come in while we wait for, for everybody to get here. We'll get, you know, get a few people and then we'll, we'll get started. Uh, Frank Perry for $2. Chili is a giant laugh. Thank you very much. Taco and Josh Gamer says, hey, say what up, Taco? Uh, let's see. Let's see. Juggernaut Jared Reed says, uh, Team Skeptic for life. I love it. I love it. Yes. I'm not cool, says Unlocked. What? I didn't say that. No, I, I, I don't want to bring, like, 50 people on, but I might bring, like, Tones, because Tones, uh, I know he, he has kind of some other information on all the stuff going on. So if you want to jump in, you can. Um, but anyway, we're going to get this started here in one second. I've got a cup of coffee. Oh, let me tell you what tonight was going to be. So I was, I was going to live stream tonight, not till later. Um, and we still might live stream later. We, if we live stream later, we'll do two separate live streams because there's people following the chili shit and they want to see this. Yeah. The chili shit is amazing. It's It wraps people up for whatever reason. Hey, I'll tell you another thing, and, and this is the straight, honest truth here, right? There's not a lot of people out there that can bring people who don't see eye to eye ideologically together. And what you have found is that and we're going to talk about it in here. It's great because I've been saying, what have I been calling him from the beginning? And everybody said, no, he's not this. He's not that. What have I been saying? Let's see if anybody in the chat gets it because I've said it so many times that Chili is a what? He's a what? Okay, not an alpha. Come on. Stop. Stop. That's not what I say about him. He says that about him. But anyway, what do I always say about Chili? He's a what? And he goes, no, no, I'm not this. I'm not this. Beta, beta. No, come on. I'm. Oh my God! I have to remind y'all. I feel so, so. No, not inner. Soft sit. There you go. Greg Pascals hit it. Soft sit. J Carr. Soft sit. Exactly. Karen, or insane. Ange Angel says. <laughs> Angel says. Karen. Uh, yeah, he's a Karen for sure. But anyway, I always say he's gonna be a soft sit, and he's a grifter. No, don't get that wrong. That motherfucker's a grifter. Okay. And he jumps from community to, he's Nathan Thompson, basically. Uh, he jumps from community to community, wherever he can go to, to get as much little, I'm a helper and I'm going to help you and this and that, blah, blah, blah. He'll talk about it in his video tonight. He'll, we'll discuss this, okay? He's bringing together 
auditors and anti-auditors to come together and say, this guy's a fucking problem. I know we don't see eye to eye, but this guy we can agree is a fucking problem. That's interesting to me. That's very interesting to me. And um, so, of course, uh, he'll, he'll talk about it. I won't go too much into detail about it. We'll let the video speak for itself so I'm not putting words in his mouth uh, that he's the one that's actually saying it, not me. But what originally was going to be today, I've had this like new found um, obsession with court videos, uh, watching court videos. It's amazing. What, it, what you don't understand is like, or maybe you do. Not, I'm saying what, what a lot of people don't understand is that um, this is the human experience. You know, you see rich people, you see poor people, you see happy happiness come out of some of these cases. People who were exonerated. You know, you see people who. Um, are paying the ultimate price. I've seen it all in just the, the one week that I've watched, and I grabbed about six court videos that I find extremely interesting that I think y'all find interesting too. That was going to be the show tonight. I was going to do a show at about 8 o'clock and do that, but then this happened, and I said, no, we'll do this first. If you know, Depending upon how long this goes, we'll make a decision whether we're going to do the court videos tonight. But I, I want to start doing that. I want to start doing a... Uh, uh, fr uh, call it Friday night case review. So as I'm going through and picking some Karen and court videos out, all these little interesting court videos I get, I'll bring them into a live stream. We'll watch them and I'll let you guys, you know, we'll run polls and, and see who you're, who do you side with the defendant, the plaintiff, uh, the prosecution, the judge, you know, we'll see, we'll see how it goes. And I, I, I know you'll love it because man, I got some fucking, I got some good cases. I got internet psychic. I got a guy who slept on <laughs> Guy who fell asleep on uh, in court, um, I got I got a bunch of them, and the judges ain't putting up with the bullshit. It's it's fun to watch, but um, I do want to put that on 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 display because it is it, it's the human experience. You know what I'm saying? We all have to go through that. Everybody does, and it's something to learn from. Number one, uh, number two, we're gonna poke fun at people. We're not gonna assume anybody's guilty, but we will poke fun at people having a good time. But at the same time, and and there's a serious aspect to it, and it's actually seeing the law process in display so if you're interested in that i say let's do it and and maybe we'll do that first show after tonight's show but we're about to get to the tonight show because i know that's what you're here for all right so let me um go ahead and uh sound off in the chat if you want real quick before i get started i'm going to read through the super chats and then put super chats on pause uh, while we do some chili investigation uh, Frank Perry, Chili is a Giant Left. Thank you very much, Frank. Lisa Rubleski, thank you very much. Ravenheart, $5. Uh, the laughs he makes are about the only thing giant about Chili. <laughs> Bridge the Divide, member 27 months, my man, JL. Team Challenge, Chili looks similar to Alan Turing. I can't unsee this. Stop saying that. That's mean to Alan Turing. P. Sherman, 999, you twisted humor makes my day, twisted humor makes my day better. Okay, regarding that, not only will we be doing a live stream tonight, but I'm covering this as a product uh, as a produced video. So you're getting kind of the beginning process of my thought, like when I or, or the beginning of my thought process, because this is how I go about videos. I do. I find a video like this that I know oh, I'm going to I'm going to do this one. And then I go through and I watch it in its entirety and I think inside my head and I speak out loud what I disagree with fundamentally. And then I go look up stuff to make sure that I'm right, because if I'm not right, I want to be right. So I'll change my mind if that's the case. Um, but you're, you're seeing it live here right now and we're going to get started right away. Are you guys ready? Who's ready out there? Tammy Reed for $10 in honor of my granddaughter who leaves on July 5th to be an Army MP. You go, Jillian. Shout out to Jillian. Oh, Sunday night, I have my, bro have my brother coming on my, for my normal Sunday stream. I uh, graduated the Navy 20 plus years as a chief. He's coming on. I'm bringing MA2 Fletcher on, and we're going to have a military talk and, and shit with you, chill with you guys. Uh, we'll watch some videos that night, too. Pat's Cap for $1.99. I like consequences. Okay, let's get started, y'all. I'm, I'm, I'm done. Let's go. We're putting uh, Super Chats are pausing right there, and we'll pick them up in a bit. Uh, here's the thing. When this video is playing, I'm going to be off camera, and I'm going to be interacting with you guys in the chat. So if you have anything to say, let me know. Let me get it set up. <laughs> I'm gonna have to fix this, but I just want to show y'all. Here's how it. Not gonna associate with anybody else who Here's works. How it came and, in. And... 
Okay, so let me fix that real quick so I can get him looking normal for whatever reason. Okay, there we go. There we go. All right, so um, it might take a second to pick up because I was recording this and it's, you know, I caught it midway and I started it at the beginning so I could catch everything. So here we go. As a, as a creator or an auditor or an activist of, of social media platform, a video was released that only showed my reactions. All right, this and then is again, good you're gonna see the same thing in this video this guy made about me. You know, it's as though, I mean, it is what it is, you know, I'm going to I'm going to stay clear of all of these because what it is when you enter into a social media platform and I know this from TikTok and you begin. Oh. Yeah, let's not forget, guys, he, he's an, a TikTok star first. One second. YouTuber second. Just real quick here. TikToker first. Real quick. Oh, let me let me boot it up a little bit because he talks go, to you people. You can't in any way, shape or form let on the just Internet. go down. Uh, I'm I'm now down in the the south. I'm in the down. Uh, I'm I'm now down in the the south. I'm in the south now. Um, when I was driving, no, I I changed it, Bill. I put it to two days. So hopefully, I'm not quite all the way. Well, I don't know where Jacksonville is compared to. I'll have to look it up on a map because I don't really know where everything is around here. But you know, it's just so. It, it's just. It's, 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 it's depressing. It's a little sad. You know what I mean? Because you try to be, you try to be a genuine person and be friends with people. And the truth is, is that everybody has an agenda. What's going on? So, you know, it looks like, um, so I'll just give full disclosure. I filed a harassment restraining order against one of the trolls today. And then in courtroom today, for the troll was someone who I thought was my friend. Can anybody guess who that friend, Mr. Uh, Karen DeCastro, uh, thought was his, had his back in court? Who, who is he suing? Who's the alpha suing for harassment? Uh, just, a, just a refresher, uh, chat. Just a refresher. Who do you think is getting sued for harassment? Who's the big bad wolf that scared the alpha into uh, into to run into the cops? Uh, just a refresher. And then who do you think the friend is that betrayed him? I'll let you answer in the chat. So, you know, it is what it is. It just, it just, matter of fact, I'm even gonna, I'm even gonna change this out. I'm gonna go like this change and then I'm just gonna go I'm just gonna change this out real quick so that I'm not surprised either man I'm not surprised at all one bit it is what it is I'm just gonna change this for now I'm just gonna go like that and I'm gonna save that and now this is gonna be called evil government sins you know, as we go down this road, remember, there's going to be people who they don't have the same goals that we do. They have the goal of being popular or being liked or being, you know, because there's a hierarchy that was created here on on YouTube. And to be honest with you, the big problem that that really escalated things for, you know, for you know, for me is that I said that it is not qualified immunity, it's Terry versus Ohio. And I've been having that talk with he, people on YouTube for a long time, that they need to focus on Terry versus Ohio. It's not my place to tell them hey, what okay. to do. Okay, I, I wanna point something out, all right? I don't particularly care about drug use. You guys know that. I'm a do your own thing type of person, whatever the case may be. And there's been a lot of other creators. I've never said anything about it, you know, like it's not my business, I, just, I really don't give a shit. You know what I mean? Um, but. Listen to how many times he repeats himself, number one. And number two, he cannot stop sweating. He just cannot stop sweating. I mean, it's just... And maybe, hey, he's a big dude. You know what I mean? I know big people sweat sometimes. Like, not 
you know, muscular people, they, they, they sweat a lot sometimes. You know what I mean? Everybody sweats a lot sometimes. Maybe Chili Hedges has one of those, like, excessive sweating things. Not my problem. But I'll leave it for you guys to decide that. I don't want to make any accusations, though. That that's There's other content creators out there that are saying this. But I, it's I'm observing stuff that looks to me like, you know, it could be. But I'll let you make that decision. Discuss it in the chat. To do. But I, I did overstep my bounds a couple times last year in 2022 when I told people, hey, focus on Terry versus Ohio. And they didn't want to hear that. So I just I just want to... You know, it is what it is. You, 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 can't, you can't get stuck in things. And, you know, the, the, the people who are on this YouTube platform who are preaching qualified immunity, which is wrong, it's Terry versus Ohio, that, we're, that, are, that are trying to push uh, for a revolutionary war, that we're going to change the social contract to a, to a new thing. You know, that, that just, that's, you know, I hammered those people a little too hard. All right, this is where he's starting to talk about sovereign citizens, all right? So what he just said was <clears throat> the people who are trying to uh, overturn qualified immunity and trying to overthrow the government, and, and these are American state nationals, sovereign citizens, Moorish nationals, these people, okay? So what did he first say? Notice what he's saying now, all right? The auditing, the auditing crowd has kicked him out. They don't support him. Maybe there's a few that do, a few that don't, but there's a lot that don't, okay? There's enough that don't where it makes him hard to be viable as an auditor, all right? So what's he doing now? He's trying to pivot. He's trying to pivot, all right? Maybe I gave those people who were arguing against the social, constru the c social contract a bit too hard of a time, all right? So I just, I'm, I, I'm sorry that I'm stopping him, but I just need y'all to point. I need y'all to see these things so you see it for yourself that he's pivoting towards being a sovereign citizen. And I called it from the beginning, and they criticized. He's not a sovereign. Yes, he is. He's a fucking sovereign citizen. Listen to him. Listen to him talk. Here you go. You know what I mean? I just hammered him a little, a little bit too hard. And I was a little bit too brutal with them because I just told them that their ideas were dumb, that they didn't know what they were talking about. I was a little harsh. I was a little bit harsh, so I, I, I could admit to that. I was a little bit harsh with those, with those folks. But it's, yeah, I think so too, Eric. They're I called think that there's soft a lot of tards. People. They're called soft tards, okay? That's what we call them. We don't call them folks, Chili. We call them soft tards. Even First Amendment auditors don't like soft tards. I think that the reason, no matter what my own personal flaws are, which we all have some, you know, what they're trying to do, the people that are trying to paint me as a woman beater for pushing a woman off of me. And then the funny part we'll is, is if that, you watch we'll uh, videos that, sh that are calling me a woman beater, for some reason, miraculously, the couple of moments before I push the girl off of me, uh, they don't show her falling on top of me. They just, it doesn't, it doesn't get seen. And That's funny, Chili, because we have your video too. And guess what else isn't seen? Ch or Kate falling on top of you. That never happened. Nobody cut that out. You can't cut out what doesn't already exist, Chili. So how the hell did how how could Kate? How did you how did you cut it out of your video since it wasn't in your video, Chili? That's my question for you. Let's ignore Kate's video. You had video of the entire incident yourself. There is video of you elbowing Kate. Push you're holding your phone up, videotaping her as you push her. So tell us again, where's the missing footage? Did you all, did you, Kate, and Josh all come together and say, hey, let's get together and cut out this, the part where Kate falls on top of me? No. You didn't. You're lying your ass off. Now, I'll say that to say this. Kate's a tough woman. I'm not going to go on the extreme and say Chili's a woman beater based on his interaction with Kate. If Kate feels that way, then Kate will say so. I think Kate's a bit tougher than you, Chili, to be honest with you. So I, I don't personally see this as Chili beating up on Kate, but you know what I do see this as? A piece of shit dirtbag who couldn't take a fucking woman, a woman, woman, Chili, woman, getting close to him. So he had to put his hands on her to push her away, to, to save him, so he could get, so to give him enough time to get to the police, to the safety of the police that you fucking hate, you fucking moron. Sorry. 
hey, if you're triggered by foul language tonight, I'm giving you the warning. Please leave. It's not going to get any better. Here we go. And, you know, you can only run into me so many times before I'm going to say, get off of me. So they want to paint me out to be some woman beater. But I, I have long-term girlfriends who, <laughs> for five years, for seven years, Susie Y, good point. Kate never went to the cops. Hashtag facts. For three years, who will tell you that I never beat them? I don't beat women. It's just, but they're trying to make me out to be something that I'm not. Because the truth is, is that they're, you know, the, the, the right way to focus is on overturning Terry versus Ohio. It's not qualified immunity. It's not. And I don't want to go to a revolutionary war and change our entire structure from the rule of law or the social contract to an anarchist or volunteerist society. I think it would cause a massive civil war. I don't want that. I want peace through assembly, through petition, through legislation. That's what I want. So He wants to be a sovereign citizen that's a statist sovereign citizen, not an anarchist st sovereign citizen. Okay? Jeez. He wants to just get rid of the entire government except for the structure of government that he wants. He doesn't, he is an anarchist to the point that he wants to separate from the United States government, create a new government, and call that the United States government of Chile. Not gonna fucking happen, Chile. You're crazy. You're, I could, I could go on about you. We'll just keep going. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah me too i mean trey you, you do have a you got a good point listen just so you guys know if i could do it again i just would have used my legs and i would have ran away from a sticky nasty troll and that's probably what i'll do in the run, future i'll Chili, just run away run. from those sticky nasty trolls you know and oh I, I'm so sorry. I'd love to pause the video so I can interject and make fun of him, but sometimes I can't fucking stop. Chili, run, Chili, run. There you go, Alpha. Just go. Here, hold on. I got to give him motivational speech time. Motivational speech time by Team Skeptic. Run, Chili, run. Go, man, go. You can make it, Alpha. That woman is scaring you. I know, but you can do it. You can make it. You're, you're fast as fuck. You're about to say so in your video yourself. Run, motherfucker, run, you alpha. God, that was the most alpha thing you've ever said, Chili. Next time I'll just run. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here, all right? And so I'll continue with what shit. I'm doing legally. I'll just continue down the line. And, and that's what I'm going to do. And that's, that's what I'm going to do. Next week, I will file in federal court a lawsuit and I'll just continue to press forward to try to get justice. You know, I didn't get case law coming to a town near you. Kate versus Chile seen in the, the United States States District Court violation of civil rights. YouTuber got too close to this guy in public. It's been documented. Chile has video. Josh has video. Kate has video. We're about to revolutionize the civil rights movement with Chile versus Kate hold the fucking phone hold my beer and get the fuck ready put on your lawyer pants because this is fucking happening when did you say chili hold on or a lawsuit and i'll just I think continue said next to press week. forward to try to get justice you know i didn't get justice in a kangaroo court today which is it's just the way it is it's just that's just how it is so i think so that i just wanted to address it because you know I think it's, I think it should be addressed. You know, it should be addressed. Yep, 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 yep. It's it just, it's just, it, remember, people who only portray you in a negative light are not your friend. Now, the thing is, is that I was warned by three different people whose channels you all watch. I was warned by three different. You, does anyone else here notice? I'm going to rewind this. I want y'all to see something that I see. He looks at his hand right now to confirm that he's actually holding up the right number of fingers. My man struggles counting to fucking three. All right. 
I'm noticing this live. I haven't watched this. I've watched, I listened to a little bit, but I haven't watched the whole thing. Look at him. He's looking at his fucking hand like, wait, is this, this is three, right? This is the symbol for three. Watch his eyes. Remember, people who only portray you in a negative light are not your friend. Now, the thing is, is that I was warned by three different people whose channels you all watch. I was warned by three Here comes, look. Told you. different people. Don't participate with some Struggling. people. That's, that's what it is. And from now on, I'm just gonna stay as vague as I can because I tell you what, listen, people can say what they want, but this is gonna be the last video I ever do addressing other people. I'm just gonna focus on the law and changing Terry versus Ohio. And that's what I'm gonna do. So it's like, yeah, yeah. You know, of, of course I wish I had done things differently. I do. I wish I had just ran away. <laughs> I, I, he said it again. Somebody keep a run counter. That's two. Somebody keep the run counter, okay? Every time he says, I should have ran, I should have ran, instead of just sitting there acting like a man. That's all she was. She's doing the same thing you do to everybody else. You can't fucking handle it. All right, so two, I need a counter out in the chat, an official counter in the chat. Keep a count. I've ran away from people before with my legs because I'm super fast. Oh, but I, oh God, I, why did I stop it? He's super fast, guys. He's, he's ran away before. He's super fast. Let me get, let me let, play that out in full, full stride for you. Don't participate with some people. That's, that's what it is. And from now on, I'm just going to stay as vague as I can because I tell you what, listen, People can say what they want, but this is going to be the last video I ever do addressing other people. I'm just going to focus on the law and changing Terry versus Ohio. And that's what I'm going to do. So it's like, yeah, yeah. You know, of, of course, I wish I had done things differently. Okay, I do. These two don't I count. wish I had just ran away. I do. I, I, I've ran away from people before with my legs because I'm super I fast. Do. But I, I didn't. I made a mistake. I should have ran away. I should have just turned and ran away from a sticky booger troll. That's what I should have done. And in the future, that is what I'll do. Because I just won't, I won't touch anybody ever again. I just won't put my... Because you guys have seen full-grown men scream in my ear that they're going to kick my butt, they're going to fight me, and I don't give any response. Because they don't touch me. The problem with the chick is that she was all over me. She touched me, she fell on top of me, but miraculous... No, the problem with the chick was that she was a chick. And in your deluded fucking mind a woman can't harm you therefore you can bully the shit out of them but a man will stand up to you that's why you won't go see Legicator in the fucking ring you're running from Legicator let's not get anything twisted Chili I hope Chili's audience is watching tonight hey audience Chili's audience that guy on screen is running from Legicator why because he's a man and he'll beat the shit out of him in a ring all that tough guy talks runs away when the dude standing in front of you can fight fucking back. Quit running, Chili. I, you know what I'd do? I'd bond you out. You go turn yourself in, I'll bond you out, and you can fight Legic. If you'll agree to fight Legicator, I'll pay your bond, Chili. That is, how many, wait, we have 1,400 people? Okay, 1,400 witnesses right here. I'm saying right now, I'll bond Chili out just so he can fight Legicator. You will, I'll arrange it ahead of time so you can turn yourself in and be out the same fucking day. You have no excuse, Chili. You're not going to go study for a bar because you don't know what it takes to get a fucking, to get, to become a lawyer in states. And you can't just go say, hey, I'm going to read this book and go take a fucking test. And hey, I'll be a lawyer and can represent you in court. That's not how it fucking works, Chili. But I'm saying it now. I will bond you out. Same day. I will organize it so that you spend less than fucking one hour in the dungeon, okay? I'll make sure they don't even put you in a dungeon, that they sent you on a nice comfortable bench outside the dungeon so you can have it all nice and cozy to yourself. But in return, you got to fight Legicator. God, I should have been on camera for that. Honestly, that wasn't shown in the video. You never see it, which is... You know, if you, if you, it's just incredible, you know? Yep. 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 So, so from now on, I'm, I'm literally just, you know, I'm just going to use my legs and I'm just going to do, 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 do. I'm just going to get out of there. Count I'm just going to run. I'm going to get away from people who only want to hurt me. 
and I'm I'm probably Count not going to associate with anybody else who works at, in as a as a creator or an auditor or an activist. I'm just not going to you know I said it myself before. I need to work completely alone, and that's the way I need to do it because then I, I have my own sense of self. I have my own sense of self. Oh yeah, I mean she was definitely harassing me, but it doesn't matter because. The other person filming, they edited it so you only show my reactions. They never showed what she did. And Bullshit. It, Josh posted it. Josh posted the entire video. I know that he pulled it down, but if anybody out there has the entire video, they can just shoot it. To, I know. In fact, I know who has the entire video. I know. I, I can't talk to him now, but I do know who has the entire. Somebody reached out to me. So anyway... Um, the other thing I want to point out here is that Chili is saying that he, that she was following him around and harassing him. This, listen to me guys, you, I cannot stress this enough. Chili is, does this to other public officials. Chili has announced that he intends on running for governor in multiple states. He is a public figure. There is no ifs, ands, buts about it. He is a public figure. He has announced his gut, his gubernatorial intentions kate as a member of the public as any auditor will tell you is allowed to take a camera and follow you around you are in public she didn't go to your home she didn't try to invade your privacy in a bathroom she went and met you on a sidewalk at a parade so good that maybe that's why they denied your dumb ass in court if you've seen me face down cops and you've seen me face down full grown men, then all of a sudden I'm going to lose my mind on, on a troll. It just, it doesn't add up. So I wanted to address it though, because I consider, I consider, um, <laughs> that's, that's the guy's name. That's funny. That's a funny name. Yeah. I, I'd be, you know, and then I was talking to a friend, uh, someone who's, who's, Yep, together. They, they sure were together. And I, you know what? I just found that cause, because yesterday... He's talking about um, in court. And when he said they were together, they sure were yesterday, together. Yesterday, was Josh and I Kate. had a friend. And then today, that friend went to court against me. There it is. I mean, that's... That's that's the way it is. I mean, there's that's just didn't say anything. It made no statement, made no comments, but went to court for another person that was I was pressing a harassment restraining order against. Yeah, really did. Really, really actually did. I was. OK, if Chili has his way. Anybody out there that's a public official, all you have to do is just file a restraining order against any auditor that comes around you and they can never come around you again because it'll just, hey, you're, they're harassing you and you can't be a public official recorded because that requires them to follow you and, you know, alphas have feelings too. Not only blown away, I was, I was hurt and uh, I just was, I can show you what I said. I just, I said, um, I'm going to, I'm, I'm actually going to go to AT&T and, oh, and change my number today it. so that I can't get trolled on this number anymore. Oh, poor guy. And so, but you have to, you guys got to think about it in terms of. Doesn't like getting trolled on his phone. Loves giving his phone number out to people so they can call him. Somebody in the chat, make that make sense for me, please. I will mod the first person that is not a mod already that can answer that question. Why? You can make that make sense for me, please. Benefit. Think about the benefit. And this is the problem I had driving down to the south here from the northeast. I kept on thinking to myself, I kept on thinking, why does this video only show my reactions and not the initial action? I kept thinking that the whole way down. Matter of fact, I talked to David on the phone about it. I, I talked to uh, another person. I don't want to say anybody's name. I don't want to get anybody involved. Um, but I talked to another person and I said, why, why was a video released that only showed me retaliating or my aggression from being, you know, physically accosted? It doesn't show anything that happened on the other way. And then that's what was stuck in my head the whole way. And this level of distrust uh, was building in my mind. Um, 
And I just was like, why was that shown? And then someone else called me, who's a popular channel that you guys have probably all watched, and said, All right, I'm going to stop it there because Josh did show the whole thing originally. It was pulled down. I don't know if it's been put back up or not, but it was pulled down. The entire video was up. Kate has a video that she took, and Chili has his video. None of this appears in all three videos. If you cannot prove that it happened, Chili, I'm sorry, but it didn't fucking happen. Not as far as I'm concerned. I told you. He said, I told you. I said, he, <laughs> that's what he said to me. Three people have all called me today and say, I told you, dude, I told you, but because I gave them my word, I would not release their names. I won't do it. I won't do it. But remember, these folks are involved in getting more comments, more likes, more followers. And if this person turns on me as they did, then they're going to double their following because they're going to get some of the bootlickers. They're going to get some of the other guys, uh, subscribers who are for anarchism or volunteerism, but can't back up a single argument, you know? And so, so you're going to gain as far as YouTube goes, you, you're, you're going to gain. And, and, and that's what I was kept thinking is why did you release a video that only showed half of it and only the bad half where I clearly, you know, could have done it better. Clearly I could have done it better. Yeah, no fucking shit. And maybe that's why he released only the parts that showed you acting like a fucking ass to show your true fucking nature. It only takes hanging out with you, I'm sure, for a few days, like Josh Abrams did, to realize that you're nothing more than a self-serving, narcissist, narcissistic, self-deluded punk. And that's why he put it up, the, the portion of the video that's up. I'd be embarrassed to be around you and say I was anywhere with you. I, I could have. I should have used my legs and ran. Right, that's what I should have done. And that's what I'll up. do in that's the future. Another one. So if, if you're going to troll me next time, you better make sure you can keep up. And so, you know, um, you, oh, I'm sorry, you guys hit the like button. I know there's 400 people in here. Do I have uh, that's cute. 200 people who actually are my friend? Do I have, are there 200 people in here who are actually my friend? Because now I'm really starting to wonder, you know, <laughs> I mean, I'm a human being, you know, I, I'm really starting to wonder like, who's actually my friend? Do I have any friends? I mean, I have friends back home in Alaska and I got friends in Texas and I even got friends in Florida, New York, Oregon, California. I have real friends who it's not based on their popularity of whether they like me or not, or they use my name in their video or they release a video that's about me. Okay. Question. Is, oh my God. All right. I'm setting up a poll for you guys to vote because I'm, I'm genuinely, I'm genuinely serious. Okay. I got a genuinely serious question for you. All right. I'm not telling you what the name of the poll is. I'm just uh, typing it before I hit enter though. I will re <laughs> hold on. Let me get on camera <laughs> real quick. I don't want to scare anybody off and Chili's got that. The look of, of craze in his eyes right now. Give me a second. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> now, before I send this poll off for you guys to vote on, and I want you to take this poll extremely fucking seriously. And there's a reason why I want you to take this seriously, because my man Chili just said his real friends with an emphasis on real. Real being non-imaginary. So now vote. Vote in the chat. Vote vote right now. You have it. Is Chili's real friend really real? And I'm going to play it back for you so you can hear him talk about how really real his real friend really is. <laughs> I have actual friends like that. Yeah, I bet you do, Chili. <laughs> and, and Texas. And I even got friends in Florida, New York, Oregon, California. I have real friends who it's not based on their popularity of whether they like me or not, or they use my name in their video, or they release a video that's about me. Real friends. Real friends. <laughs> I have actual friends. friends like that. Actual <laughs> friends. I miss those friends. I bet you do. Andreas, I miss you so much, brother. I miss you so much. Just a, a genuine loving man who is my friend. And I miss that guy. 
I'm gonna I'm gonna go see my buddy, you know. Uh How, how do I even know? How do I even know? Uh, the judge ruled against me. <laughs> I did list off. Um, I did. I, I did a well, lot of. A, yeah, yeah, that's a good way to know, Chili, whether you want or not. The judge ruled against you. So you went in there and filed harassment charges on Kate and lost. Meaning what, Chili? Meaning what? She wasn't harassing you? Run. Run, Alpha. You fucking Alpha. You run so far. You run until you can't run anymore. Oh my God, here we go. Being for this, I learned from my Tempe case that you really just have to sit down in court precedent. And so I listed the course precedent. So I'm gonna appeal obviously, and I'm gonna file a federal civil right. I'm gonna file a federal lawsuit in district court because we're in two different jurisdictions. And we'll see if a federal court sees it as Every what one it of is. those officers so that he I'm ran to because are gonna be added to that civil court. Every one of those officers he ran to are gonna be added to that case. Watch. Watch, he's going to be like, well, I went to three different officers, and all three of them let the big, bad, mean woman keep harassing me. She was violating my civil rights as a dumbass. Allow it. Um, um, I think so, too, Shanta. I think so, too. I, I mean, I, I <laughs> Super pretty necessary much... Super necessary court um, abuse. Dun, dun, dun. I have heard of Carl Miller. I, yes, I have. I, I just now, I think though, from now on, I, you know, and it, it already has built up inside of me, you know, um, I'm, I'm going to just be weary of, of trusting people who are involved in the space of influencing or video creating. That's what I'm going to do. Yeah. Good. Okay. 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 I want y'all to hear this. All right. This just said on me right now, camera time, camera time. This just said on me right now, guys. Chili just said he's going to avoid doing work with influencers moving forward. Now, why would that be? Let me ask the chat. Think about this logically for a second. Think outside the globe earth sphere, okay? Why would Chili decide not, he'll work with other people, but he won't work with influencers, all right, now I'm gonna go look at the chat and I'm gonna see if anybody is thinking like I would, I am right now. All right, give me one second. I'm gonna play his video so I don't have to stop it, but I'm gonna look at that and then I'm gonna stop it in a second and I'm gonna go over why. I believe Chili will not work with influencers moving forward. There's a very specific reason why he won't do this. Here we go. I'm gonna be, I'm just gonna be super weary. And I've got, uh, I've got three friends. Well, two friends and one new kind of friend who we talked on the phone today and he's the one who warned me he called me in massachusetts and said get out of there get out of there dude he called me in massachusetts and i said no no don't worry about it it's all cool it's all good i guess it's not so <laughs> so it's just like you know all right so the chat is absolutely seeing what i'm seeing or at least some of you guys are he will work with people but not influencers because look if the people want to expose him for being the jackass that he is, let's say he would have went to Ironton and nobody gave no coverage of it, right? And just did what he did to the people in Ironton and is boop, out, gone, running, running off to Boston to be scared off, scared out of that fucking city, okay? <clears throat> if there wouldn't have been anybody there to speak about that or talk about that, it w no one would know what happened. So now moving forward, guess what he's going to be able to do? He's going to be able to go and because his his followers are a cult. OK, they're an absolute fucking cult. He can't do any wrong to a lot of them. He's shaving them off. Those that aren't. But those that stick around are absolutely a cult. So he can run any narrative he wants on them. It's when he works with a bigger creator that he does something stupid like he always fucking does. That's going to expose him. But they have a voice. And even if Josh's, Josh Abrams' channel is smaller than some of the other channels or whatnot, people will, follow, people will hear about it if he speaks about it. Everybody's wanting to watch Chili right now. This is new Chili news. They will be going to Josh's channel and checking him out. He has a voice. Chili can do this to, to little people. Who gives a fuck, right? He'll just tell everybody, hey, no big deal. I, I got to run down to Texas real quick and go help this other case down here. I, I'll i be back up to Kentucky next week. 
And then when he's down in fucking Texas, he's like, oh, I got to go back out to Arizona. I'll be, I'll be back in Dallas next week. Well, nobody asked him about Kentucky because he don't give a fuck about Kentucky. He got everything he needed from Ironton. You think he's going to go back to get his ass kicked by Legicator? If, one in the chat, if you unironically think he's going to go back to Ironton to get his ass beat by Legicator. Again, I'll pay for your bond money, Chili. I'll work with Legicator to make sure that you're not in fucking, you don't get fucking treated bad, that you get treated like a goddamn prince while you're in there so that you don't uh, uh, sustain any injury while in custody of the big bad police tyrants. All right. Sorry, I don't want to interrupt too much. Maybe I'll swing through Iowa. I don't know, but but it is it is Look, just so you know, as, as a human being, Fuck, why not, you know, right? who is, I'm a I'm I'm a pretty deep empath. You know, I'm I'm pretty empathetic to others, oh, oh, and I'm pretty empathetic to, this, to other people's listen needs, to this. and I'm pretty empathetic just to to humanity in general. I genuinely care about other people, so to watch this and be a part of it and and for for me to be the actual person who p so many people make a living by using my name it's just so weird to me because the remember same way i'm you still use just a regular fucking, human being you, the same way you use the name of dead people to make a living chili don't fucking act like you don't do that same goddamn shit but you're, this won't be the first time you you pull some hypocrisy shit tonight. But this right here, using my name, using my go look at my videos. Not one of them. I have Chili to Karen in here. You know what I mean? Like people people know Chili, but I'm not putting delete laws in my shit. I'm not putting Chili to Castro, Juan, whatever your name is, or Jose Mar Maria Cash the Castro, whatever the fuck. I don't put your name in this shit. I don't need your name. People like to laugh at you because you are you, and it doesn't matter what the fuck you, who the fuck you are. You you could be the, a random person on the street. You say the same shit. You're going to get laughed at by people like me. And when I watch the videos of me go into Ironton and go into Struthers and every place, in Forney, in California, in Arizona, in Massachusetts, when I actually watch back a video of myself, I don't recognize the man on the screen. I don't know who that guy is. He's a lot more brazen than I am. He's a lot more brave than me. I don't, I don't recognize him. And I said this. It's called self-control, Chili. It's called self-control. If you don't recognize the person you are when you get angry and you lose control, then you need to go get help. That is not me trying to be funny. You are going to hurt somebody who is around you if you don't. We've already seen you snap at the people around you to shut up because they're interrupting your First Amendment, your First Amendment crusade. So if you don't recognize yourself when you look back on your videos, then stop being that person. Previously to, to someone who's recently betrayed me, I said, I don't even know who that guy is. So, you know, it's like, but it's just so weird. It's just so weird. I talked to a friend of mine because a friend of mine called me a few minutes ago and was like, man, I can't believe, you know, people are texting me and calling me about you. And I, and I said, well, so far, have you ever seen anything that I've done? You know, listen, I, could I handle it better with the troll? Yeah, I should have just ran. I should have ran. Just run because they're Add trolls, they're boogers, Pl they're sticky. Remember, three. if you punch a bucket of slime, when you pull your fist back out, you got slime all over your hands like Ghostbusters. So, so, so. But one of my buddies just called me and said, um, I warned you, man. I told you. He, he just, there was three people today who all said, I told you, dude. I told you. Well, one told me last night, you know, I, 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 I don't know who to trust. And so for that reason now, I'm going to distance myself from other people who call themselves activists or creators. I'm just going to stay away from them because it just seems as though, you know, because of... You really need to stay away from everybody, Chili. You really do. Just, just for the benefit of society, stay away from everyone. The value that I offer to them financially, because remember, you know, you, you value, you, you, you have a value. If you, if I can put Melanie M, if I can put Melanie M 
Melanie, good to see you. Thanks for the comment. I appreciate it. Thanks, you guys. I appreciate it. Um, if I put Melanie M in my subject title, and then I know I'm going to get at least 5,000, 10,000 views, well, then that's a financial gain to me. I make money doing that. And if your principles are so flaky and flighty that you would go and associate with people who are completely and utterly against you, and you'll go participate and go be on a panel just for their attention and for their time, so people will listen to you and see you, then you don't really have the same drive that we do. You are completely missing why Josh is where he's at. Because what you did was fucking wrong. And even he knows it. He's not over there because he's best friends with Kate and this was a troll the whole time. He's over there because spending a few days with you was a, enough for him to realize that you're not a fucking, you're not the person that you're trying to convince everybody you are. That I do. We have different drives. I have a drive to create change no matter what. Don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I, I, th this is going to pass. I mean, th th listen, just to be honest, you know, this hurts. It really hurts. It hurts. Hold on. We're going to start this over. Okay. I'm going to, I'm going to, this, this is where I need. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. We got to I wish I had some sad music to play. Let me, hold on. I can do this. I can get sad music up for us. Give me a second. This is necessary for the time being. Sad music, copyright free. Because we need to talk about something extremely serious right now. All right. Let me put it on loop because it might take more than three minutes for me to say what I have to say. Chili dog. Sweetie. Life can be hard, man. People, people can get close to you in public and film you. And, you know, I don't know how else to tell you that we're here for you. Like emotionally, nobody should ever, no alpha, no alpha. Let me repeat one more time. No alpha should ever have to run from a woman ever chili we're here to support you and if you're in the chat and you support chili's emotional distress by all means it got it got kind of crunk guys i'm sorry this is this is not proper mood let me restart this it that was improper mood i apologize but if you support chili's emotional distress right now please put a one in the chat um but back to what I was saying, Chili. We will be here for you, okay? Just keep your head up. Sovereign citizens out! Alright, enough with the fucking drama. Chili, shut the fuck up. Nobody gives a fuck. You're fucking alpha. Get the fuck out of here. You ain't shit. It does. Oh, yeah, I would I break I down and cry, but it it's not going to do any good. And then people and just we don't care. We have different Here we go. drives. Everybody. I have a drive to create change no matter what. Don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I, I, th this is going to pass. I mean, th listen, just to be honest, you know, this hurts. It really hurts. It hurts. It does. I would break down and cry, but it's not going to do any good. And then people would just make memes of me crying and it wouldn't do me any good. You know, I'm probably just going to go for a run. My hamstring is finally okay. Uh, do you remember the day I was doing the sprints with Zayner over there in, um, we were actually in New Hampshire. So that's where I was. Um, my hamstring pulled the day I told Zane not to pull his hamstring. I pulled my hamstring. So I haven't been able to exercise for five days. I've been, I've been, I've been hemmed up for five days. Yeah. There's a, well, in this day and age, he did a great job. He was wiped out afterwards. I was still strong, but my hamstring was ruined, ruined. And, uh, by the way, you know, Zayner hadn't, uh, hadn't done any running. He hadn't, he hadn't done any running. He hadn't, he hadn't ever done sprints that he told me he said he'd never done them. But, you know, I just, I got a headache the size of Manhattan, you know, because it's like, it's like, man, it's like, what a drop. <laughs> but I should have thought about it. I should have thought about it, you know? And I did think about it on the way down from Math, from, uh, from New Hampshire down here to the south. I kept on thinking. I called David, 
uh, one of my supporters on the phone. I called, uh, Jim didn't pick up, but I called David and I said, man, you know, it's, I'm just, I, I just can't square it in my head. A guy released a video of me that only shows me in a bad light and doesn't show the moments before. And I just can't get over it. And that, that was two days ago. I, I said that two days ago. I don't think Excedrin's gonna clear up this headache. I think this headache's gonna be here all day until I go to sleep again. It's just, you know, just, uh, I, wish, I wish I could say, oh, it doesn't bother me, man, I'm Teflon. No, it bothers me, it hurts my feelings. It hurts my feelings for sure. It really does. It hurts my feelings. And this is what you call is a taste of your own fucking medicine, Chili. This is the taste of your own medicine. This is what you do. How do you think the human beings that work as our police officers feel when you go around and berate them and people like yourself? Do you not think that maybe they go back home and think, man, what I'm doing really protecting people? You know, I'm, I'm out here working my best and my ass off to... to you know make this community better and and this guy's screaming in my face for nothing i didn't do anything but try to help him or, or the person next to him but no that's okay for you because as far as you're concerned they're expendable you're a real person they're not fuck you chili fuck you i'm not buying your little sadness oh poor alpha bullshit jesus man this is the type of shit that pisses me off they think that it's okay to treat other humans as if they are robots and then turn around and go oh but please think of me and my kids and this and that i'm a human just, just a human shut up stop being a hypocrite how about that yeah big time big time big time, big and, time. you know stop. and then if you're gonna we have to talk about the physicality that i had with the woman when she fell on top of me multiple times look you're you you can't jump on someone and not expect them to to just push get off of me because remember i'm not sure you know and i'll and i'll just say it i'll just say it if i push you and i shock you boy you'll know it i mean listen i've already said it i know what i am i know what i am so if i a really really large chipmunk that's what you are you are you are an oversized chipmunk that ain't about to do shit unless it's a woman if a woman's in front of you you have no problem pushing her out of your way actually push someone to try to actually physically fight them they'll hit the ground if they're not ready so i didn't push any woman trying to hurt her but just pushing her off of me because she had been all over the top of me and um it's just pathetic it's just pathetic but this this is a this is just a smear campaign you're seeing it you guys you guys are all watching it you're all watching it you're, everybody gets to see it it's hard to smear somebody who smears himself daily you know, uh, and then, oh, is that Shauna? Where, Shauna, where you been, huh? And I sent All you right. a text yesterday. We said, we, I, said I thought chipmunk. you were going through some stuff, and so I just... I said, said chipmunk, I'm going to speed this up just a bit so we don't have to spend all night going through him rambling on about nonsense. But keep, keep count of the run counter. It comes up a few more times. Just tried to give you, you'd been working so hard, Shauna. Shauna had been working for, Sh Shauna's in the house, everybody. Shauna had been working for four weeks, Whoops. maybe longer, straight, where she was doing mom job, her job, and taking stories from people and taking in information. And I think she just got burnt out and needed a little bit of time off. You know, so I think that it's good to see you, Shauna. I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're here. Hi, Shauna. Good to see you. Good to see you. So, you know, I don't have any vitriol. I don't have any hatred to, to spew out. Am I, am I disappointed that, that, you know, I don't, I don't think, you know, anything I say will be taken out of context. So I'm just going to walk away. I'm just going to walk away. I love how he says that everything I say will be taken out of context, but we're literally playing his video in every video that's covered about him. Nobody's just... I mean, there's people that are doing it satirically, but non-satirically, nobody is pulling out just clips and moving them around to make you look bad, Chili. You do that well enough on your own. I'm just going to, it was, it, it was nice to know you. Take care of yourself, buddy. Good luck. But uh, our time together has passed, obviously. So I wish you the best. You know, I wish you nothing but peace and love and happiness and good luck. What can I say? You know, um... Uh, snake in the grass straight up no other way to see it i mean it is what it is so you know it's it's you just get to this point where you know and and i'll say it for the third time 
I should have done it better. I should have ran. I should have ran from the troll. I shouldn't have. If she fell on top of me, I should have just take off sprinting. That's two times. I made her had to keep up, but hey. I didn't do that. I made. He said I should have just taken off sprinting. That is essentially running at a high pace. So there's three times now. Add three to the count. Here we go. A mistake. I turned around and said, "Get off me," and that apparently now, uh, throughout the history of my life, I guess uh, there's no women who have been beaten. But now apparently, you know, it is what it is. And I and and just so you guys know, um, you know, the legal process takes a long time. It takes a long time, and often you don't get justice, and so you have to just keep on going up the chain until you do. You know, on some of these cases, like for example, like uh, for, I just don't want to say anybody I'm associated with right up. now because I don't want them I don't to get hatred. Listen but to there's who have a Stop. monogamy going to work out for me he's because to, I hate cops. He's trying to. Uh, he's trying to cite case law so <laughs> we all know how that goes well I'll, I'll skip you the bore and we'll get back to to his emotions coward it was just like when i had to go to the cops had i have to no go choice to the cops. I, I have to go to the only Ex excuse me wow talk about placing the cursor in the exact right spot let me do that one more time so people can hear him say that I had to do it. Had, meaning no other options. I had no other options but to run to the people who torture and abuse people as per what I say. Don't want to say anybody I'm associated with right now because I don't want them to get any hatred. But there's a case oh, the that we're working on right now that we're assisting. And in that case, it's, gonna, it's probably going to go all the way up to the highest court in that state. And so you just have to be ready yeah it's 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 your damned if you do you're damned if you don't <laughs> if 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 you do engage then you're terrible if you don't then you're a coward it was just like when i had to go to the cops i, I have no choice i i have to go to the oh. only oh oh that's cute if you do engage you're terrible but if you don't engage you're a coward do I have any auditor friends who happen to would like to tell me what else that's called? What they like the, the term they use? Is anybody out there familiar with the term that every single auditor says about every cop? Because if a cop engages with them, the cop's truly a tyrant. But if the cop walks away, it's the what, chat? It's the what? So now Chili's saying, "Oh man, this is my only two options." Is to engage and be the bad guy or walk away and look like a coward? Jesus, fuck. He's got the walk of shame. Look at that. They, I don't even have to tell the chat. They know what you're talking about, Chili. You do this to yourself. Stop doing this to police officers. How about that? How about that? How about identify a bad police officer that's actually bad and you can criticize him the way you criticize good cops who are doing their job? Hypocrite, right? Coming up. Monopoly on force. I have no choice. I have to go to the people who have a monopoly on physically intervening. And it's not going to work out for me because I hate cops. I hate cops. But that doesn't mean I shouldn't get... Until you need them, um, Chili. Get it straight. He paused for advice from Skeptic. I'll keep oh, giving yeah? it to you. Is that yeah. right, Tennessee Accountability? And then the really, the really crappy part, just so you guys know, here was the, I'll tell you what was the hardest part for me this past week. Uh, Zayner was there, uh, uh, Zane was there when I was doing it. Um, I had to break down videos to properly create evidence slips to submit to federal court. The hardest part was reading the live chat replay of people who come here, who or my friend, or at least... I love it. I'm going to let this play, but I love how, how he says the hardest part, and I'm going to substitute what he said. He said was reading the live chat, blah, blah, blah. But what I'm going to translate for those of you that are not fully chilly fluent is he just said, what bothers me is those people that were attacking my ego. That's what he was saying. They're, they're my friend here. They're my friend here and then reading what they wrote on other people's channels who they were in their live chat. It was hard for me not to, it, 
it was hard for me not to be offended. It was hard <laughs> to not be offended because it oh, just, you know. I love it. I love it. Um, chili, poor chili. I don't know chili. how to say your name properly. How do you say that? You say it, uh. Shiz, uh, stilts, stilts, what a stilts, moron. stilts. Is that how I say your name? I'm not sure how I say it. Yeah, words are hard. Yeah, Chloe. I can't either because it. You know, look, the words people who try to make hard. fun of me or cut me down or they use my name to make money, you know, um, Stigs. So I mean, Stigs. We we. You know, I, I got nothing but love for you, man. But you know, you're you know, you're as out there as I am. We're we're the same far out there. So sometimes you might say something, Stiggs, that if people don't know you and know that you're not, you know, out there, like, and by the way, I'm saying I'm out there too. Um, they might misconstrue it as, you know, because look, I mean, I think we do see that. Oh, it's hard to say that. But I, I, I you know, I just don't want to say that. It's not the right way to say it. I love it. I love it. He's struggling to get fucking words out. He can't even think straight. I do need some friends. I do need friends. Yeah, to say the least. It doesn't look like I'm going to be able to be friends with people who work in this space. There's a couple people. There's, there's, there's three that I'm friends with. Uh, two that I'm definitely friends with. And one is a new friend. We just started talking. Um, well, we've been talking for a while. But, you know, the idea of friendship is a whole different thing, isn't it? The idea of friendship where, you know, you have each other's backs. You know, even if you have a disagreement, doesn't mean that because we have a disagreement that I'll get more popular if I turn on you. And, you know, it's funny. When I left, when I left Massachusetts, I said to that snake in the grass, I said, I said, you know, if you turn on me right now, if you turn on me, you're going to get all of that guy's uh, followers who preach uh, qualified immunity, and he's completely wrong, who preaches a volunteer society that he couldn't back up any arguments at all whatsoever, that he showed he doesn't know anything about the basis or the philosophies of the Constitution. I said, you're going to get all those people's followers. I said, then, if you turn on me, you're also going to get all, you're going to get a portion of the bootlickers. Who yeah, yeah, because we all agree that you're a moron. And if we got to come together to laugh at you, we're going to do it. That's just how it works. Who they're, they're saying glowing things about you that, you know, you did good, that you were the peacemaker, you were all these things. So you're probably going to get, a, you know, a thousand or so from there and a couple thousand from there. You're going to grow a lot bigger if you just turn on me now. And the snake said, I'm not going to do that. I wouldn't do that. But then the snake went to court today for someone else. After I called yesterday and said, hey, will you go to court for me? Because I got I to gotta get this, I got to get this taken care of. And oh, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, Chili. Josh didn't go to court for Kate or go to court for you. He went to court to tell the truth. And the truth fucking hurts, doesn't it? Now, you might not have seen that as being for you, but that doesn't mean that he went in there and lied for Kate. He went in there and told the truth about what happened. And that is why you lost your case. And I cannot help but laugh inside. It is amazing to see Josh Abrams turn on Chili intentionally or unintentionally in a court environment. And Chili is now 0 for every case he's ever filed. He's an 0 for. So. Fucking loser. You're behind me? Paranoid too. Hurts. Hurts for sure. Hurts. You got me, buddy. You definitely hurt me. Good job. So. Poor Alpha. Put poor Alpha in the chat right now. And then Stiggs gets timed out. <laughs> I don't know what you said, Stiggs, but you, you just you just got you just got timed out. You just got timed out. The chat was you know, moving, and then by the chat was moving too fast for Chili to form letters into words, so he couldn't tell what Stiggs got timed out for. Smooth move, Chili. Way to way to display your fucking grammatical dominance there. The way, and then you know, the 
the horrifically bad, the actual bad past of the other person is forgotten because there's someone worse than you around. So, you know, what are you going to say? You know, yeah, and I've, I've heard that a few times. So I just wanted to come on here and, and hey, Vincent, thanks, man. God bless. Thanks, dude. Appreciate your support. You know, and, and just, you know, <laughs> it's just like, you know, it, you know, I could have done it better. I could have done it better. I should have done it better. I just got to take, you know, two fingers and two thumbs and just say, you know, I could have done it better. <laughs> just say, who's the jackass? Take those two fingers and two thumbs and go, who's the jackass? Who's the jackass? Hold on. Let me get on camera. This is inappropriate without me being on camera for this one. Like this, Chili. Who's the jackass? Who's the jack? That's what you need to be doing. All right? That's what you need. to Take those two fingers and thumbs and describe yourself. And then stop being that guy and go make, go touch real actual grass instead of constitutionally protected grass. Just go touch natural grass like a normal human being does and make an actual fucking friend in life. Don't go searching for the one person that's going to be your friend who agrees with everything you fucking say that can be your goddamn sidekick and run your fucking camera for you. Go make a real friend for a change. It's nice. That's just the way it is. I, I should have, could have, would have, and done it better. Would have, could have, should have. Done it better is what I should have done. I should have done it a little better than I did. So, hey, G's up. What's going on? Hey, just letting everybody know that Masshole will be streaming tonight, uh, and we're, I'm going to shoot everybody over here to over there. So we're going to get through this video. We won't do the second stream tonight, but um, we're going to get through this video as quickly as possible, and then I'm going to shoot you guys over to Masshole so that way you guys can... Uh, she's going to be discussing the actual court hearing today, the part that I don't have access to. Unfortunately... I'm going to take a break from streaming to go watch her. So we'll get through this as quickly as possible, but just know that that's what the plan is, guys. Here we go. What's going on, Tim Lyons? How are you, buddy? I got Sarah's uh, text today, but obviously um, my brain is a little bit... Uh, my, my head hurts so bad. My, my head hurts so bad. My head God, I, I can't help but point out that when you... In a computer, right? In a processor. All right, Chili, listen up. In a processor, when you try to run too much information across the fucking individual transistors, they fucking heat up. Alright? You're trying to process too much information across the singular brain cell that you have left. Calm the fuck down, Chili. Jesus, fuck. This is what happens when you process too much information across a singular brain cell. It hurts so bad. It hurts. It hurts so bad. Burns, doesn't it? Yeah, I'm for overturning qualified immunity as well. I really am. But I think Terry's more important. Qualified immunity is in the top five or six, but I'd like to, you know, we saw that today, by the way, in uh, Egbert versus Bow, uh, Bull. We saw that. We have them in stock now. There's, they're, they're going out again today. Uh -oh, so we were time, out guys. for about five or six days there. And then I'm sending off two free ones today. I'm sending one to Eric. And then I didn't get the email from the other person that we're sending them off to. So I'm sending out two free trifolds today. You know, so it's like, I got to be honest. My head just hurts so bad. It just, my head hurts so bad. I can't even, I can't even to describe it. I guess, I, I guess when you, when you feel pain, um, when you feel emotional pain, I, you know, I guess it's, it hurts your brain, you know. It hurts. I, I, I wish I could tell you that it doesn't hurt. I really do. I wish I could say this doesn't hurt me at all. It does. It does. You know, you got me. You, you got me, bro. Good job, man. I can't take a nice bath. I'm in a hotel. I'm in a, I'm in a, uh, a hotel here. And uh, so I, I really can't. I really, really can't. I know I'm, believe me, I know that today will pass. I'll wake up tomorrow and it'll be better. But today for the rest of the day is gonna, it's just gonna hurt. It just hurts right here. This is the specific spot in my brain where it hurts. Love you too, Frogmaster. Good to see you, man. Good to see you guys. It's good to see everybody. So, you know, but I don't, I don't have a bunch of uh, mean things to say 
I was genuinely trying to be somebody's buddy and, uh, you know. It's funny how even nobody likes a piece of shit. It doesn't matter how much a piece of shit is trying to be nice to you. When he shows himself or herself to be a piece of shit, nobody wants to be your friend. Anybody who finds that out about you is constantly pushing themselves away from you. Ironton Auditor did it. Josh Abrams has done it. I, I, I can't even name the number of people that have pushed you away, Chili. Does that not? Is it everybody else is just fucking stupid? Or maybe is it that you have a fucking problem? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He's going to, he's, no, he's, gonna, that guy's going to grow. He's going to grow a lot because he's going to get the, the volunteerist group who are going to all endorse him and go follow him. And then he's going to get some of those bootlickers because he went to court for a troll. Wrong. Showed up to court for a troll. That's what happened. Because maybe it's not a our side versus their side thing. Maybe we're actually fighting against two different ideological positions, Chili. Do you ever think about it like that? You ever think that maybe there's a Venn diagram that we all can get behind and it's getting behind fighting against stupid pieces of shit like you? So, you know... Yep. Oh, yeah, we have 40. So, and just so you know, the last, uh, we, uh, he just said we went to 42,000 subscribers. You know, um, half of them are hate. I'm hate super subs. stoked that we're at 42,000. You know, I, w I hope it's going to be a million soon. But, <laughs> you know, we just got to get to a place where what? we actually institute the change. Oh, God. This is comedy gold, guys. Did he just say what I thought he said? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. He's going to, he's no, he's going to, that guy's going to grow. He's going to grow a lot because he's going to get the, the volunteerist group who are going to all endorse him and go follow him. And then he's going to get some of those bootlickers because he went to court for a troll. Showed up to court for a troll. That's what happened. So, you know, yep. Oh, yeah, we have 40. So, and just so you know, the last... Uh, yeah, we, here it uh, comes. He just said we went to 42,000 subscribers. You know, um, I'm super stoked that we're at 42,000. You know, I, w I hope it's going to be a million soon. But, you know, <laughs> we just got to get to a place where we actually institute oh, the change. Oh, a million. I love the enthusiasm. <sighs> I'm a real woman, Chili. Oh, thank you. <laughs> we and, love oh, the I, enthusiasm, I said, Chili. I said, thanks, bro. Sorry about that. Uh, David, we were out until today. The trifolds are shipping out today, David. So, it, David, what's your uh, email me your order number, David? But your, your trifolds are shipping out today. All the trifolds are shipping out today. Pamela Knox, what's going on, Pamela Knox? I'm, I may be able to get up there. I'm, I'm trying to. I was going to. Actually, I can't. I can't say anything about location and stuff like that because uh, apparently today the, the the judge says it's okay for people to to track you with with a Discord account. Oh, this is beautiful. Now, okay, he thinks, guys, okay, brace yourself. Let me go on camera. This is funny. We don't need sad music for this. We need exciting music, but we're not going to put any music on. We're going to go blue screen, blue light. All right. He thinks that he can be tracked using Discord. He thinks, I don't know why, but he thinks using the Discord app, allows Kate to find his location at any time. I don't know what to say about it. I'll leave it up to you guys to, to laugh at that one. But that seems like a pretty fucking easy one to laugh at. Discord does not work like that, Chili. I'm sorry to tell you. <sighs> and we'll see what the federal court says. But, yeah, we'll but see. According to the, we'll see. According to the... Uh, State Court of Massachusetts, it's perfectly fine to say that you're tracking someone through Discord. It's, I mean, that's that's what was said today in, in court, that it's okay. It, it shouldn't put you a reason. And I here's the, here's the worst part, is that for court today, I listed off all of the, I listed off all of the case precedent, all of it. I listed the case precedent for every one of my arguments because I didn't want to have a repeat of Arizona where I didn't have, where I didn't have everything prepared. 
So this time I had everything prepared. I mean, I had, I, I listed the case law that, that explains the reason why I should win the case. And, and you still lost, Julie. <laughs> Oh, that research! What what does that tell you, Chili? What does that tell you? It's a little bit harder to be a lawyer than you fucking thought originally. You had did all the research, all the case law, all this and that, and you still lost because you are a perennial loser who will never believe or understand that you are lacking in any legal knowledge, ability whatsoever. You read some books, you think you got a good fucking thing, a, a good case for memory retention, and you like to spit back what you think you remembered, but you don't know what the fuck you're doing and it shows in court. Well, you're welcome, Chili. Good job. You know? Thank you. I appreciate it. I, I just, you know. It, oh, sh oh st how do I say it again? Stills? <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, brother. I, you know. Terry versus ter Terry Law, Ohio. What, what is it? Uh, Amanda, Amanda Jose. I never know. I never Stiggs Stiggs that's his name Stiggs I'm so sorry you got timed out man I, I don't know I don't know I can't see what you said you just get timed out I don't I didn't see it though man I'm sorry I, I hope that that uh, maybe Stiggs is turning <laughs> I mean I don't know if he is I don't think so I don't know I think Stiggs is just kind of one of those guys that just says some things that he wants to say so I don't know I hope you're not turning Stiggs I hope you haven't gone against me um, it's not about me. That's the that's the funniest part is it's not about me. You know, but I think it's um right. So K Bones, you know, um, you know, if you notice K Bones, because I had to research all these videos to file federal lawsuits, and I'm just uh, K Bones said something. I, I know he is. Sorry, I, know I can't deal with him talking as slow as he does. Um, and when I researched the video that's out that has that features me having a physical altercation with this chick. I, I watched it back because I had to watch it last week with Zayner over there in uh, New Hampshire. And I couldn't figure out where the beginning of the video was. And then I listened to another guy say, well, where's the, the videos cut specifically like this? And then I heard what the guy said, but even though he was telling me that I just turn around and shove a woman, you'd be gone. All of you guys, there wouldn't be a single person here. So all of you know that this chick was falling on me. If she wasn't falling on me, I wouldn't have said, get off of me. And I didn't go, get off me. I said, get off of me. There's a big difference between actually going at someone. And then let me say something else. No, Chili, we saw that part. That was where you kept walking in front of her and you kept intentionally stopping to try to make her walk into you. We all saw that part. That is the part, that's the part you were, if that's the part you're saying where she fell down on top of you, Kate didn't fall down. And if she did, where's the video? Where's the video? You don't have it, Josh doesn't have it, Kate doesn't have it, because it doesn't fucking exist, Chili. So go back to trying to explain why you pushed a woman. Here we go. And then I went to the cops and I said, can I throw her on the ground? Can I pepper spray her? Can I punch her? Right? I'm showing that right I have no cops. recourse. I'm not saying I don't have any pepper spray on me. I didn't actually want to pepper spray her. I'm showing the audience who's, who's watching through the camera. I don't have any physical recourse. A woman can fall all over me and I, I can't punch her. I can't push her. I can't knock her down. I can say, I'm going to knock you out. Right? But it's just hyperbole. I literally am showing you that there's no recourse for me other than going to the police. I'm sorry, but it wasn't hyperbole when the male cop noticed you do it and came back over and told you that you were breaking the law and that you were going to go to jail if you continued to do so. He saw it just like we did, Chili. Okay? You weren't innocent. You didn't play this, this role of the good citizen just out there to tell, you know, all the children how fucking much they should hate cops, which is what he was doing. Kate was just the one that stood up to you. I mean, there are other people that did that, and they should be commended too. But Kate went out there and stood up to you and put it on video. And you don't like, you hate that. To the point that you ran to the cops. The one thing you say never do, you did it. And then you went to the government. You ran straight to the court and said, courts, please help me out. And they told you, you're fucking crazy. No. And now you're like, oh, well, I'll just take this federal. Good fucking luck. Good fucking luck. There's nothing I can do. Because if, if you guys for a second thought that I turned around and just shoved a chick, none of you guys would support me. None of you. I wouldn't expect you to. If I'm just turning around and shoving women or I'm shoulder checking That's them. Exactly no, she'd fall into me several times. That's and then I was like, exactly get off. Me. What he did. You don't have a right to just assault me because you want to. And then she's gonna make up, oh no. It's just like 
Oh no, Sean, I, I, I pushed her away. I said, get off of me. But of course, that part by the snake in the grass is cut off. It's not there. You see me reach over and say, get away from me. Not get away from me, get away from me. That's what you see me do. But you don't see the five seconds before that because it's cut out, which made me lead no, to wasn't. believe that it the whole thing was a scam. The entire was... thing was a scam because what effective... I got his video that I covered on it off of his channel. It's not in there. Everything he's saying is in there that was cut out is not in on his video that he's he was there. He was recording the whole time. He was live streaming. Hundreds of people were watching thousands, actually, because if you take the his channel plus the tro the the troll channels, as far as he calls them, if you take everybody that was live streaming, thousands of people witnessed you do this, Chili. Nobody saw what you said. And that was live that guy did he ended his beef with the person who had trolled him forever and by the way i went back and i watched those videos i went back and i watched them so what that guy does is he ends the beef with the troll that he has then he gets the crowd from the volunteerist who i clearly whooped in a debate just whooped him like he was a little kid because he didn't have any answers because he's not real smart brave not real smart not real smart right we know that not not an intelligent person brave not bright let There's me guess difference. not like educated usually... how about that Maybe not stupid, but not educated, that's for sure. Doesn't know any of the founding documents, doesn't know Federalist, doesn't know Anti-Federalist, doesn't know Leviathan. And someone said I'm saying Leviathan wrong. Am I saying Leviathan wrong? Am I saying it wrong? Am I saying he it says, wrong? He's, he's acting as if he knows. Okay, get this, guys. Get this, right? Let's, uh, pointing out hypocrisy. That's what I do. He's saying, I know this, 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 I know Leviathan. I know Leviathan. Wait, am I saying that right, guys? Okay, let me... Um, let me break it down to you. I know math. I know science. I know algebra. I know, in fact, in algebra, I know plus, I know minus, I know multiplication, and I know devising. Wait, is it called devising, guys? I'm an expert in math. I know all this, but can someone in the chat please refer to me? Is it devising? Am I saying devising right? That's not how it fucking works, Chili. When you're fucking an expert in these things, you don't have to ask, wait, am I saying it wrong? No, you correct people who are saying it wrong because you've studied this and you know the material. He is a hypocrite. He doesn't know what he's talking about. He's grifting off of everybody and fuck him. Did someone say I'm saying Leviathan wrong? So, anyway. So, yeah, I'm just gonna, uh, but, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm not in my work line. I'm saying it correct, aren't I? I agree, V-Boyer. I think you're right. I, by letting... Yeah, yeah. And then that's the other thing that I saw in her. Just so you know, when I, when I was at that event, I said, hey, I've told you to stay away from me. And then the person I was with said, hey, do you want to hang out with us for the day? And now that I think it back, that person's getting rid of his troll and putting that troll on me and then... Filming it like, oh, I'm having a great time. Watch, I'm watching the trolling happen. Okay, so this is why, this is one of the key reasons why he lost his lawsuit, guys, okay? Because he was with Josh, admittedly, and Josh told Kate, you want to come with us for the rest of the day? Now, whether Josh was asking that sarcastically or not, he invited Kate to follow along. Kate accepted the, the, the offer and followed along. That's not harassment. But I remember the words, hey, do you want to hang out with us? And I was like, no, I don't want this person to hang out with us. But then he had invited this person along. And that's what makes me think the whole thing was like a fake friendship, fake setup. I can't, I can't, I mean, I can't shake no, it. I can't it shake wasn't. it. And that's probably why I have a headache because my, you know, it's cognitive dissonance. You have two different ideas in your head and they just, they, they don't jive, but there's two ideas in your head. One, that uh, this guy's going to be my friend and we can be buddies and these things. Is. The other, this person's not your friend at all. They brought you here to set you up. They brought you here. They know that there's going to be a troll that comes and attaches to you. And they know they're going to slide that troll onto you. So. I'm not really tired. I just have a splitting headache. Just my head is just. I mean, really. Uh, it's the fucking brain cells I'm, I'm, putting in overtime. Uh, John, I guess. Uh, D. Johns, I guess you didn't see the video that was created today. I guess you didn't see it. So, um, he doesn't. He doesn't, apparently. I mean, uh, and, and, you, and D. Johns, you know that, you know, D. Johns, if you think that's true, so D. Johns just said that uh, he, he wrote what he wrote. So D, then I challenge you to do what I did this week. Go back and watch that person's live replays, and what you'll see is, is this dude in the chats supporting. Go, go look at the live replays.
Go, go look at the live chat replay. You'll see that these guys are buddies. No, no, th th that's not trolling. That's, that's friendship is what that was. So, I mean, look, you know, D. Johns, we don't have to have a falling out. You don't have to support or believe in anything that I'm doing. You know, I, I don't, you know. Good for D. Johns, whoever so you are. It is what good it is. for you. you, know, you made the right it is decision. What it is. Run. I agree. Yep. I think I am going to do that. Yeah, he did. So I think I am going to do that. I'm going to meditate because I do know how to go into very deep meditation. <laughs> I just have to. I have to go there and get there. That's what I have to do. He he learned that while sleeping through osmosis, uh, alongside his constitutional um, education that he received, uh, was done. He's actually. Believe it or not, the super necessary human is actually the only human on earth that can put in 48 hours of study every 12 hours of daylight, okay? Just so you know how insignificant you are, uh, the super necessary human can do 50 times what you can do, okay? Just so you know. That's what I have to do. Yep, it is what it is after a while. You just have to... You ripped Great Lakes off? Is that what you just said? Far lap moves? It's, I don't think you meant that because Great Lakes and I talked last night. I don't know what you're talking about. You you ripped off Great Lakes? Is that what it is? Ripped off Great? What? Do you, I'm not sure what you're talking about. But just so you know, when when uh, what helps your headaches? I don't know what he's talking about because. Uh, there's people who I'm working with right now regularly that uh, he's talking about that that's just not true or we wouldn't have been. I mean, we talked yesterday. <laughs> what are you talking about? It's all, and in the future, I actually, next time I have one of these sticky, smuggy, you know, nasty trolls, I'm just going to see if they can keep up with my sprints is what I'm going to do because uh, I don't know. Uh, counter. Who's the counter? Uh, keep it up. I think he's just going to keep up with it, see if they can keep up with my sprints. All right, here we go. More running talk. Need it? You know, I don't need it. It didn't do me any good. It just hurt me. You know, it just, it just hurt me involving myself with a snake and then people who would go, who make videos about me to hurt me, to try to hurt me. So you just can't have anything to do with any of that. You just have to, I mean, I've seen, I've seen that guy in here before. So I'm trying not to block people. I'm trying not to block people. Except so, for anybody know. that disagrees with you, Chili. Absolutely. He <laughs> said that, I hope your eyes he has said that in more than one time, block anybody that, dis that, that comes in here trolling. If you and, and they consider having a difference of opinion trolling. Read in that last one that your eye was bad, so I wanted to, to get back to you. Green grass for headaches. I'm going to stay strong. Listen, and I am strong. I'm strong as strong can be. Uh, trust me. Uh, you, you, you can't be me and not be strong. You can't be. Wow. Because, wow. You can't be me and not be strong. Think about that, guys. In the past week. Okay, since Memorial Day, he has run, and this is what, like 10 days, 10 days. He's gone to the, the police officers at the parade three different times, four different times, three different police officers, four different times. He's gone to the police station um, to follow up on his, you know, half ass report in the middle of the parade. He's also then gone and filed a, a, a court order against Kate to leave him alone. He's gone to court. Okay. It's not, that's not tough. Tough would have been just to say, fuck Kate, and let it be that. That's what tough would have been, but you know, no, no, Tilly. No, 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 you ran, ran to the cops as fast as you could. Oh, I love this. You can't make this up, guys. What happened to me today, right? Most people, you know, I don't know. Um, that's not true. Uh, I can't say that. Some people would, would certainly break down crying. When you go to great depths to explain He's the rule of cry. law and show the case precedent to the judge and then the judge holds against you and says oh no it's free speech tracking you down at an event and f causing a physical altercation it's free speech then you caused the physical altercation know, on camera we got you all good d johns all good man listen i don't i don't i don't remember seeing your name on those fraud pages when i was reading the live chat but there are a few people in here um who i did see in the live chat over there on the fraud pages who i did see say things about me that were pretty rough they were pretty rough. There's people in this room right now of the 500 people who, yo, what's going on, John Felax? How you doing, brother? Good to see you, John. Good to see you, man. He can't bring oh, Ashley, him. You guys, John he cannot. Did you hear that? He was getting ready to say, I know there's people in here of the 500 people he was getting ready to say that are watching me because they fucking hate me. Not because they're here to support me, but to hate me.
to hate watch. All right. That's what they that's what he's about to say, but he can't bring himself to it. He in, instantaneously, whether he knows it or not, he automatically looks for something else to jump to before saying that those 500 viewers aren't legitimate 500 followers and supporters. God, the alpha in him is so strong, guys. I wish you guys knew how much alpha was just flowing from the screen right now. John Felax is in the room. John Felax has an absolutely amazing channel. Uh, you guys should all subscribe to John Felax. I watch his videos. Uh, I, he's one of the few people that I watch, but I watch his videos. You guys should all check out his channel. He's highly educated. He knows the laws inside and out. You know, and uh, John, I'm still willing to have a public discussion with you about laws and stuff like that, but I'm not going to debate about anybody anymore because stuff when like I that. absolutely whooped that guy who uh, used to be an auditor, but now he's a reporter, when I whooped him in a million pieces and he couldn't answer any of the questions, it just caused a huge division. So I don't want to have a debate with anybody again. I just want to have a, have a discussion, a discussion about rule of law and a discussion about the right process. Does anyone else ever notice that he never brings up his debate with me? The one where I molly whopped his ass? Am I the only God? This was this happened in flat with Flat Earth too. When I used to debate Flat Earthers, because I'd molly whop the shit out of them intellectually as well. And they wouldn't say anything about me because God forbid Team Skeptic bring his intelligence to a fight. Chili won't say nothing about our debate. He'll talk all this all about James Freeman, which I didn't even see the debate. People said that. Freeman lost or whatever. I, I, I don't know because I didn't see it. I don't want to make any assumptions, but there was no question about our debate. I treated him like the child he was. And he didn't know what to fucking do. He won't bring that up. He won't say, oh, but and there was that time that, you know, Team Skeptic smacked me around. I learned how to fucking not, not, do, not participate in a debate during that debate because he certainly showed me. Is for us to live under rule of law. And by the way, you know, uh, someone wrote me yesterday. I'll, I'll show you guys the video. I'm, I'm, I'm not in a place right now to be digging into my computer. But he said that he used the trifle. And yes, don't let me uh, forget to remind y'all that Chili did say that me and him were friends. Good, good point. Good point. <laughs> All right. Now, we're going to play this part because this part's important because he's about to talk about his trifold. And he's going to talk about the effectiveness of his trifold. And he has a very specific example that you guys need to hear. So that you know. It's indestructible, by the way. And by the way, you know, uh, someone wrote me yesterday. I'll, I'll show you guys the video. I'm, I'm, I'm not in a place right now to be digging into my computer. But he said that he used the trifold the other day and it worked like a charm. He said he used it exactly as I taught him. He said he started off with the, with the, with the Fifth Amendment where it says you have to answer questions. He showed it to the cop and said, no, I don't. I've asked him for the video. I'm at, I hope he's going to send me the video. But he said Fifth Amendment right. And then the cop said something else. And he said, um, actually, I'm just going to go ahead and remain silent. And he showed him the trifold again. And then the cop said, whatever, threw the trifold back at him and said, go on and let him go. So it does work. It does work if you use it. If you All right. So <clears throat> from, from the inventor of the jock sock. Hold on. Let me get on camera real quick because this one's going to be a good one. All right. I'll get my stream, my stream deck set back up. But from the inventor of the jock sock comes the indestructible trifold and the purpose of the indestructible trifold uh directly from the creator is this right here all right if you annoy the officer enough with it the officer will throw it back at you and let you go that is literally its only effectiveness is annoyance if you can annoy the officer long enough with the trifold there's a 10% chance he'll throw it back at you and let you go. That's it. There's nothing in the trifold itself that does you any good. As per Chili, just now, he just now said it. The officer read the Fifth Amendment part and said, no, nope, don't care. Read the other part, said, nope, don't care. Stuck the trifold back out at him and he said, okay, shit, whatever, here you go, get out of here. It happens. There's lots of cases where cops are lenient to people. But the trifold itself you could have handed him a banana. You could have said, here, officer, here's a banana. And the banana goes, what's this? He goes, that's my rights. And you could have in entertained that guy enough to make him throw the banana back at you and go, get the fuck out of here. But instead, you, you sell a trifle. This is free. You can go to the store and get bananas at like fucking 89 cents a pound. Shit. You would think Chili would at least invent something like th the jock sock had fucking potential, right? Keeps your penis warm. 
You get pulled over and the cop says, hey, uh, answer my questions. And you say, actually, officer, uh, I'm invoking my Fifth Amendment right to remain silent. And you show him this and then you don't speak anymore. It worked. It worked. I'll, I'll find the email. I'll take a screenshot of it and I'll put it in community. So this did work. Oh, Random Country, is that you who wrote me? Random Country, was that you? It might have been you. Uh, John Felax is in the room, everybody. He's got a huge channel and he's an amazing uh, dude. He's got a lot of brains. Unfortunately, John, I can't hang out with you and I can't be your friend in real life, but I can be your friend online. I'm not going to be friends with anybody in this space anymore. He can't I'm not going to associate with anybody life. in this space. There's, there's two dudes. There's two dudes who have really big channels that I am going to hang out with, that I am going to still hang out with it, who are my friends. Um, but I'm not going to, I'm not going to make any new friends in this space. I'm just not going to, you know, I'm just, I'm, yeah, I know. I, I'm, I'm your friend, John. I just, I'm just, I'm hurt. I'm, I'm a little hurt. Poor Chili. That's the best way to put it, John. I'm just a little hurt, man. I definitely would like to be your friend. I really like your channel and I respect you. I respect how you do it. So, Hashtag um, poor I'm just, Chili my feelings in the chat. Right now, you know, I was just big time betrayed, so. No. All right, guys, we're getting to the closing minutes. Closing minutes. Random country. Was that you, random country, that sent me the email? I'll scoot it up. On Felax. Yeah, uh, breaking the flaw, actually, you know, if, if it's okay, uh, what he sent to me on text message. Oh, random country's got a story here. Eric, be glad you don't make videos because it's absolutely incredible. It's absolutely incredible. Be glad you don't make videos. He makes videos in his free because, time. What's uh, he so talking anyway, about? So anyway, so I like just want to talk about breaking the flaw real quick here. That's like the worst advice you can give somebody is to say, I make videos in you know, my free time, but don't do it. You shouldn't do it. Yeah, let Chili do it for you. He'll, he'll do it for you. Don't worry about it. Just real fast. So he, he came in today when I was in court, he'll and he 100% showed up to support, and he was down to support. And so I'll show you what that looks like. Uh, because he came in in a big way. I mean, he came in in a big way. I mean, he said the same thing to the judge that I said. He said this right here. He said, I have received hundreds of phone calls, thousands from her followers. Hey, I have not reviewed this, okay? But if they show any revealing information, nobody contact anybody, please. You're not doing me any favors by contacting somebody and being hateful, so please don't contact. I have not watched this, so I do not know if there's any private information he's flashing right now but if you see some do not contact him please thank you very much love you guys psa out disrupted me when i was at work and then followed me to a bar where her thugs then threatened me and he actually showed up yeah i i, I agree della perry i i did push kate away from me i i didn't shove her but i distanced myself from her i pushed oh, her away so get off admitting, of me that is correct he's admitting to assault she was in his private space so he pushed her. He put her hands on her. But according to him, he's not a woman beater. I'm not making that ac accusation. I'm just reporting on the facts. You are right. And I have said I, I should have done it better. I should have just ran. I should have just ran. Where's my I run counter? Two. Add two of them. Run counter. Add two. Turned and ran. I mean, I, I think that I already, I already said that. I already said that, right? So anyway, I want to thank uh, Breaking the Flaw, who did show up for me for court today. I'm super grateful that you did that, dude, um, even though the judge didn't take anything into consideration. You know, yeah, Michelle, she did more than that. She was falling all over me. It was just horrifically bad. It was horrifically bad. But in the future, I just won't allow anybody to... Not the real John Felax? Gosh dang it, now I just don't know. Yes, that happens on the internet. I deal with it all the time. The There's a delete John laws I mean, out there. There's not the del real delete laws, and it's funny as shit. Subs. Will the real John Felax please stand up? So, what's going on? What's going on? How you guys doing? Starting over again. Like I know it. It's, it's just so strange. It is just so strange. Um, you know, I, 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 I don't... Is that how live streams are supposed to be random? Am I supposed to ask you guys how y'all are doing? What's going on? What's going on, Chad? How y'all doing? Welcome to Team Skeptic Live. We've already done this intro at the beginning, okay? My bad. Let's go. I don't know if I want to cry. I do have a double XL, Josh. You do want to Oh, Josh, cry. that's right. Hey, man, sorry about that. You could see it in his okay, eyes. Okay, Josh, I just added Josh as a moderator. Josh6706. He's my Facebook friend. We've exchanged a lot of emails and messages. Um, so... You know, you know what? It's so funny what you just said, uh, King. Listen to the warnings we give you about these scumbags. It is so funny because there's three people, three of them, all have huge channels on YouTube. One called me in Massachusetts and said, you're making a mistake, dude. You better get out of there. And I said, no, no, it's fine. 
pride cometh before the fall. You need to listen to other people. Yeah, Aaron, by the way, uh, thanks a lot, man. You know, Aaron Queen, Yeah, there's um, never been I read such your comments God. on he'll the frog. Never, he'll never understand that quote, nor he will, will he ever see how it applies to him. Pride comes before the fall. Chili? Oh, my God. And then I stopped it on a memeable face. Oh, Lord. Auditor's pages. Hold on. Thank you, ah! Aaron Queen. No. We had a memeable face, and I, I fucked it up. I have it on autoplay. Okay, whatever. I don't care. But pride cometh before the fall. Remember that, Chili. So appreciate, because Aaron Queen, he went over, or she, I'm not sure if it's, if it, I think it's a he. Fuck, that Aaron was a good Queen face. went over to, thank you, Eric, I got your address. When the, when the frauditors made videos about me, and I had. Hey, Law Talk with Mike. Good to see you, my friend. Good to see you. Big, big, big fan of Law Talk with Mike. If you're not already subbed, go sub to him now and then come back here and watch the rest of this stupid shit. But I love Law Talk with Mike. He's the man. And uh, yeah, me and him are good people. I had to read all the comments of what everybody had said. And there's people in there who, who um, you know, that come here that said really bad things about me over there. And I just have to not take it personally and just be like, just keep going. Uh, but not Aaron Queen. Aaron Queen, when they said vote one or two, he voted in my favor. And when they said, what do you think of this? Aaron Queen said, no, that's a good person. I don't know what you guys are talking about. Like Aaron Queen's comments on the frauditors pages, because I had to download those videos and, and go through it. Dude, thank you yeah, so much. I appreciate the kind some, things you said in the face of people hating me. Hold you on, let's get this. I want to get I mean, through this quicker you know, so the, we can the, get the over, the everybody grass. over to Kate's because Kate deserves uh, to be to view. This is all because of her. So we need to go show Kate support. So let's get through this. We've got 10 minutes left. It's on 1.3 speed, so we should be getting done with it in about six minutes. All right, six to six and a half minutes, we'll be done with this, all right? And then we'll run, we'll run through Super Chats real quick, and everybody, while we do that, everybody else can go uh, hang out with Kate. Clearly saw that I, I don't really make any money from YouTube. I make money from donations and people who buy my products. That's called YouTube, The most money shit. I've made on YouTube is $1,249. And the snake... Lies. Snake in the grass saw that himself with his own two eyes. But the whole thing was, was really a setup for him to get more subs and more followers. That's what the whole thing was a setup. I have to believe it because why would you release a video like that? It just shows me, it doesn't show the, I thought about it the whole way down here. I drove for 24 hours straight. And so it was like, you know, love you, Work Lion. Absolutely love you, dude. One of the most genuine people. And, he, and Work Lion's a moderator for probably 10 different channels. I mean, probably 10 different channels. I still do want to help people. I still do want to help people. People don't want your help. I agree with you there, Nima. Josh can't be held responsible for Chili's actions. You're correct. Oh! Oh, he admitted it! He admitted it! Josh can't be held... Oh, look at that face. Let me turn off autoplay so I can go ahead and make it to her. Okay, my bad. Hold on. Here we go. All right. There we go. Now you got a memeable face. Josh can't be held responsible for Chili's actions. Absolutely right. That's why it's it doesn't make sense for you to say that Josh was there for Kate. Josh wasn't there for Kate. Josh went there and told the truth. The truth hurt you. All right. Memers, get to work. You are correct. I woulda, coulda, shoulda done it better. There's no other way to say it, but I'm certainly not a woman abuser, and I certainly didn't want to hurt a woman. If, if I, you know, I have an immense amount of physical uh, ability. If I wanted to hurt somebody, I, I could, and I didn't. I just wanted to get them off of me. Don't fall on top of me anymore. Stop tripping over my feet. I don't want to get an assault charge because you keep on falling on top of me. And Then you probably shouldn't have put your hands on her, Chili. Same way, if a cop did that to, oh my God. Could you, oh my God, can you, oh, please chat. Go nuts right now. Could you imagine what would happen if a police officer pushed Chili like that? If, let's say, let, let's go back to the original encounter that Chili had with the officer in Tempe, Arizona. The one that really brought this all to light. If that officer would have picked his hands up and pushed Chili, what would, it, what would Chili have done? What would he be saying? And I'll just leave it to the chat to discuss that. By the way, the, just so you guys know, the crowd there, the crowd, you know, half of the crowd really was not a fan of me. So if I had done anything that was cr incredibly abusive, I think those dudes would have taken me down. You can't take on a bunch of dudes. You're going to lose. So, so, yeah, so, no shit. you know, if, if I wanted to, if I wanted to hurt uh, somebody, in this case, it was a chick, 
I could have. I, I didn't want to. I just wanted him off of me. Just get off of me, you know? So, Legicator and, has volunteered yeah, to let you Yeah, 311. Uh, you guys hit the like button if you would, please. Everybody take your fingers and just hit the like button. Just take it and just, just take your fingers and just go like that. Pretty please with cherries and sugar on top. All right, with cherries and sugar on top, you heard chili. We have 865 likes right now. Can we just go ahead and get that to a solid stack? A thousand likes. Chili, let me play it again. Chili asked. He did ask nicely. I will give him that. He's very polite. Look. There, the crowd, you know, half of the crowd really was not a fan of me. So if I had done anything that was cr incredibly abusive, I think those dudes would have taken me down. You can't take on a bunch of dudes. You're going to lose. So, 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 <laughs> you know, if, if, I wanted to, if I wanted to hurt uh, somebody, in this case it was a chick, I could have. I, I didn't want to. I just wanted them off of me. Just get off of me, you know? So, anyway. Oh, we're at 951. Yeah, 391, 311. Uh, you guys hit the like button if hit you would, light. please. Everybody take your fingers and just Push hit the it. like button. Just take, it's it and a just, finger. just take your Push fingers. It. Just go like that. Ding. Pretty please with cherries and sugar Ding. on top. That would mean an absolute. Um, 966, yeah, I, 976. You know, we're getting there, guys. Let's go. I just, you know, I know it. I know it. Trash Nuggy. Trash Woogie. Trash Woogie. Trash Woogie. You know? And, you know, I, I don't want to create a, uh, more, you know, but it, it seems more. like there's a war against me because I called out that I'm for overturning Terry more than qualified immunity and I'm for rule of law. Thousand likes. Thank you, Chili. Thank you for asking. Please, with cherries and sprinkles and alpha beans on top. Law versus anarchy or volunteerism. And so that has created a kind of uh, angst against me, you know, uh, and so, you know. Hey, I'm calling out flat derp right now. Flat derp. Flat Derp, I'm calling you out right now. We need chili videos from you. We need chili videos from you more than the world needs water right now. Would you please start doing chili shorts for Team Skeptic? I will play them every night. I will get you so many subs. Millions of subs uh, I will bring to you, Flat Derp. Millions and millions of subs. Just please start making them. You know? <laughs> I mean, you know, you know what I mean? <laughs> so, so, so it's, it's so funny too, because I went to a couple of popular channels as I was going down the list and looking at things and a couple of super popular channels have taken little clips of me and put them on their page. A couple channels that are super popular. What? No way, Chili. No way. Are you saying, hold on, let me get on camera. I'm, I'm actually genuinely surprised here. Are you saying that people clip your videos, the stupid shit you say on YouTube? Are you saying people like me, moderately sized channels, I'm not huge or anything, but moderately sized, we take your videos, clip out the parts where you say you're being fucking stupid and put that on display and make fun of you? Color me fucking surprised, Chili. I am just, I cannot believe that they would violate your federal civil rights like that and your, the 1968 internet rights of freedom of speech. I cannot believe that they walked all over that, Captain Chili. Sue America! Took, uh, thank you, Amanda. Thank you for the support. I appreciate it. Amanda Jose. Thank you. Beautiful name, by the way. What's going on, New York Tyrant Hunter? Good to see you. I was just, I just drove through New York. I just drove through there. I agree. We need rule of law. I'm for rule of law. Terry is exactly how they violate your Fourth Amendment right. Exactly how they do it. So, oh, uh, you know, Bob's going to be happy to hear that I heard from you, Shauna, because we just talked about you last, uh, we talked about you last night, uh, Bobby Law and I did. We wondered if you were okay. Oh, I saw something about this Bobby Law guy. This Bobby Law guy, I think, represented PayPal Patty, okay? So, the, I don't know what channel it was on. I saw it and I was like, oh, God, that sounds right. And they played both the voice because Chili had a voice call with him where he played over the intercom. And there was another video with PayPal Patty and it sounded just like that guy. So Chili may be using a lawyer who's not actually a real lawyer, by the way, guys. He's never been, uh, he's not a real lawyer. Is trying to use a not real lawyer to be a lawyer that's already previously lost many a lawsuit in his life just like Chili perennial loser and also represented another perennial loser by it goes by the name of PayPal Patty good choice Chili yeah there's you, you, I'm also against Marxism I'm against communism I'm against uh, socialism I'm not for those things I don't support uh, uh, critical race theory I don't support that I think that that people are born equal I think people are born equal. I don't think anybody's born privileged over another person. So I, I just, I just want to keep it real. I want to keep it real. I'm not going to get and political. For, the, for those of so people who think I could have done it better, deal with dealing with the troll, time. I agree. I could have done it better. I should have done it better. I should have done it better, and I will in the future. 
In the future, no one's ever going to fall on top of me again because they're going to have to be able to outrun me. I'm going to uh -oh. do the Shia LaBeouf. You guys remember Shia LaBeouf running from the Two. running from the paparazzi? He said it twice, guys. Where's my counter? I at? know it. I know it, and that's what I should have done. Woulda, coulda, shoulda. That's what I could. That's what I, I. And and I and I and I, I guarantee you guys this. That mistake by me won't ever happen again, because you know this this really hurts. It really hurts. I want to petition. I want to petition Kate. Okay, we need to sign an online internet petition that Kate from the Masshole Report, the the ex oh my God, the the meanie troll, the 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 harasser, the serial harasser. We need to get her. We need to sign a poll. We need to get one going. An online internet petition to make Kat, uh, Kate from the Masshole Report sing "I'm Sorry" to Chili De Castro. You know that "I'm Sorry." So, so, yeah, Kate, do it now, Kate. Alphas have feelings. You, you are so mean. I, I hope this message gets to Kate. You, ooh, ooh, I, I hate people like Kate that make people like Chili look bad. Just kidding. I love Kate. She's a boss. But still, she needs to sing I'm Sorry. It really hurts. It hurts my feelings. So it, You see? I don't yeah. even have to make the shit up. I don't even have to make the shit up. That came straight from Chili's mouth. See, Kate, you heard his feelings. Jesus. I can I can feel the pain in my head. <laughs> hey, there you are, John. No, that's the real John Felix. Unless unless the guy, um, that's the real John Felix. That's the same picture I'm looking at on the John Felix profile. It's the same one. So it has to be the same one. Oh, I know that, Pamela. But but isn't it funny that the person who filmed that never caught that part of it, Pamela? He never caught her falling on me, never caught us tripping. We literally tripped over a guy you with a broken leg it. where she tangled in my feet, and I fell over a guy who had his leg in a full cast. So, mm, anyway. You didn't catch it, Chili. I'm on live chat. Anyway, listen, Jeez. I better get the flock out of here. You guys, we got the paper back in. So we got the paper back in. I got the trifolds are available again. I haven't had any for five days. So now I'm finally going to get to ship out trifolds today. If you haven't ordered one, you can get a free trifold just by putting the word free trifold in for the $15 version. And then you download it and you print it out yourself. Uh, a random country, he just used it the other day. And he said that it worked like a charm. Oh, man. Oh, Z hey, just so you know, uh, Zyke Patrick, can I get a jock sock tank top? Dude, I don't have any of those anymore. But let me tell you something. I sold thousands of those tank tops. People love those tank tops. They, they love them, guys. The jock sock tank top. Okay, so I want to take back all the shit I've ever talked about. Chili. Let me get on camera because I got to be sincere about some shit. Chili, I'm sorry, man. You know, like I've consistently called you a perennial loser. I've said, I've pointed out how many lawsuits you've lost, and I said how everything you do is an absolute failure. But I neglected to to realize that the one thing that you could actually sell in life was a jock shock or jock sock tank top. <laughs> so, who here would like me to make? A jock sock shirt and sell it on Teespring. Who would buy one? I'll make it cheap as fuck. I'll make it che as cheap as I can possibly make it for you guys. I will make a jock sock t-shirt and I will I will get a an artist rendition of Mr. Karen DeCastro's face here to go on it with it. So maybe, I don't know, we'll put a, a cute little saying on it or something. Ask me about my jock sock or something like that. If you would buy one, I'll make one and I'll do it for free. I don't even want to make money off it. I just want people to walk around that has a shirt that says, ask me about my jock sock with Chili's face right here. Would you buy one? Jeez, lackluster. Good to see you in the chat. Good to see you in the chat. Appreciate you coming by. Um, let's go ahead and keep going with uh, the last. We have like two and a half, three minutes. So I'm pretty sure I'm going to let this just play out and then we'll shoot everybody over to Kate's. Absolutely love them. They loved them. So anyway, uh, get your trifold. I have them back in stock now. We're going to ship out orders today. I'm looking forward to that. Um, my head is just rocking. So I better get the flock out of here. Put a jog sock on it. Yeah, get a, get a trifold on deletelaws.com, and then I'll put, I'll put, uh, then I will put uh, the video of how you use it. And make sure you guys know this. This is a big one. U.S. versus, Bra versus Bradley in 2002. Cops cannot look in your locked glove box. They cannot look in your locked console. So if you don't know okay. this 2002 this case of the U.S., of anyway, listen, I've got to get on a class, if, if that. <laughs> because, uh, uh, yeah, but I, I, I create products that will help people, and I sell those products. That's what I do for a living. <laughs>
because I don't make enough money on YouTube. In, so, indestructible trifle. Apparently, I have to... Um, thanks, Chuck. I have to... Um, oh, thank you, Les. I appreciate you checking on that. Thank you. I appreciate you checking on that. So, uh, you know, I just have to justify everything that I do. So, I sell products. That's what I do for a living. Anyway, listen, I've got to get... Um, I gotta get the flock out of here. Yes, I do, trash woogie. Yes, I do. I feel like I'm gonna vomit, so I gotta go. Uh, thanks for coming by. I appreciate it. And no matter what, man, listen, this isn't gonna stop. Coming me. off the this drugs that make me. you get is sick to the you? stomach. It's, oh, thank you. Is, is this gonna stop you? Because this is not gonna stop me. Just the goal. Saying. Listen, if I, God forbid, die in a car accident today, it doesn't stop the goal. It doesn't change anything. So people saying things about me or trying to paint me as some sort of crazy, abusive person, I, it doesn't change what I'm doing. You're not gonna stop me. What you have done, though, is cross yourself off my list, and I'll have nothing to do with you ever again. Not ever. If I were you, and I was not already on the list of crossed out people that he is going to have zero to do with ever, forever, get on that list as fast as you can. That's that's the cool kids list. I'm on it. I believe Lackluster's on it. We're, we're the cool kids. We're, the, we're on the cool kids list. Get on it. If you're not already on it, get on get on Chili's. Uh, not going to fuck with you list. That's my suggestion. And do it as fast as... Run to it. Hey, speaking of running, what was the final count on the run meter? How many times did Chili say, Oh, well, you know what? I should have just ran. What was the final count? Highest number wins. Highest number wins right now. 23. Let's see. Do we have any numbers higher than 23 for the Chili runs? 27, I see. Unlocked is winning. 25, 24. So that 1,000 Bob Nodell's gyroscope has taken the lead on the chili run meter. All right, guys. Look. So I'm going to read out the super chats and everything, and I do appreciate everybody coming out here tonight. That was amazing of y'all to be here. We had quite a few people. I think this was my largest live stream ever, so I do appreciate you guys uh, truly and deeply. I appreciate it. Um, I, like I said, I was originally going to live stream and do um, court case reviews, which I have some great ones, but I'm not going to do that tonight because I want everybody to go to Kate's live stream. All right, Kate's an amazing person. She deserves the uh, the viewers. So if everybody would like to head over there, I'm going to read out the super chats and say thank you to everybody. And if you want to stay here, you're more than welcome to. But if you want to hear the saga, I'm going to go over there and catch up. But if you want to hear the saga, head over there. I'm not sure if she's live right now. Moderators, moderators, moderators. Uh, will somebody please share Kate's live stream link in the chat? And I'm going to get to the super chats because they cleared on me. I got to go to my studio to get them. Give me one second. All right. I think these are in reverse order. So, yes, they are. And you know what they don't have? They don't have member messages. So let me read off the member messages first. Uh, has somebody shared? Oh, it's 30 minutes? Okay, good, good, good. It's 30 minutes. We'll go ahead and um, we'll share. Uh, but still, moderators, put the link into the chat for people to, to follow that uh, when, it's, when it's done. So they can go put a notification on. I'm definitely going to be done by the time she starts now. So uh, let me just start out with member messages first, and then we'll... Roll back and do super chats in one second. Uh, Beach 8. My man. Hello, Father. You the man. Thank you, my son. Thank you. I appreciate it. Um, <clears throat> the plot hole. I really do, Beach 8. You know, you've always you've been there for a long time. Thank you very much. The plot hole. For 23 months, a member. Woo! My man. Good friend of mine. In real life, friend. We both live in Dallas, and we communicate regularly as, a, you know, person to person outside of YouTube. And I can tell you, man, I, I really appreciate uh, Johnny O over at the plot hole and uh, family, family too. They're, they're good people. Uh, well, poo late, late to the party. Once again, chili is a le little crybaby. insert word. YouTube won't let me super chat here. <laughs> Hope y'all have face palm protection. How many letters left? 18, nine TW. <laughs> I have no idea what that means, but um, Strelog became a new member. Thank you very much. Richard Moulton became a new member. Thank you very much. And the Bio Explorer also became a new member. Thank you very much. Mystery Man, member 15 months. Is this to be a lesson on how to be an alpha? 
Every chili video I cover is a lesson on how to be an alpha. Get that right, mystery man. Come on, man. Come on. I don't cover them for fun. These videos are here for you to learn how to be an alpha. By Chili DeCastro. All right. Tammy Reed upgraded her membership to Dinger Slayers. Thank you very much, Tammy Reed. Mr. Macaques. New member to the Rage Dingers. Thank you very much, sir. Brainy Beaver, 32 months, lighter, lifted, high, waving, slow, I believe, Papa Skeptic. Ah, oh, thank you very much, Brainy. Appreciate it. All right, good deal, good deal. That's all the members uh, chats that I have. I know there's going to be some that I missed that canceled out when I swapped over, so my bad on that. Let me take a drink real quick. Ah, all right. Now we go to uh, Jenna B. Expectation vs. Reality says Josh uploaded that video, video and immediately took it down when he saw it caught Chili assaulting uh, Kate. Love you, Team Skeptic. Yeah, I know. And then there were people. I, some people have it. I, I I know for sure one person that reached out to me that had it. And I'll, uh, oh, God. I'll, I'll reach out to them. I saw this. Frayed Edges, five Aussie dollars. Make a jock sock beanie, LOL. Ha! Okay, done. That too. My brain hurts for five US dollars. Sounds like he's also setting up his uh, excuse to run from the fight with Legicator. He is uh, Tequila Mockingbird. I love that name. Tequila Mockingbird. Uh, Kate wins. Fatality. Two dollars. Thank you very much. Freight Edges for 10 Aussie dollars with no message. Thank you very much. Freight Edges. Appreciate you, brother. Um, Serenity Salvador for $1.99 uh, US. Fund for Chile to sue America. I know, right? I mean, if you're if you live in America, just consider your, yourself part of his civil rights lawsuit. That way, he's suing you in advance. So when you do approach him, he also probably will put out a PPO against you. It's literally going to read Chili De Castro PPO from the citizens of America, right? That's what it's going to say. And if you're a citizen in America, then tough shit. You can't get close to Chili. It's harassment. Pat's Cats for $2. Great job tonight, Team Skeptic. Thank you. I had a good time. I really did. I did this whole stream by myself and hadn't done a solo stream in a while. It felt good getting my getting my streaming wings back. Yeah. Plus, he made it easy when I saw the video. I was like, God damn, I'm going to cover this shit live. Uh, Jackie Joe for 5 USD. Thank you very much. Trade wins 1964 for 5 USD. Thank you very much. Order of Tush, tush Cream for Table 6. <laughs> Raven Art, five. Thank you very much, Trade Wins. Raven Art, five U.S. dollars. He can't. He can't just beat up, uh, beat anyone with the law unless he use unless he's using the law book or a club or flail. Uh, he will never. He's a perennial loser. He'll never. The one time. Trust me when I say this, guys. The first time that guy defeats a traffic ticket, the entire world will know. There will be 20 chili videos on how to beat a traffic ticket, how to use the first, how to use your third amendment to beat a tra the traffic ticket. That's what the video will be about. Third amendment doesn't have anything to do with traffic tickets, but chili will find a way to make sure you know that he beat that traffic ticket with the third amendment. Whatever. Uh, some old dude for five U.S. dollars. I think chili wears headphones to cover his hair. Where his hair is turning. Ooh, good point. Good point. Some old dude. I got. Little couple of gray strands coming in. I'll never hide it. Just rock the rock the intelligence. Uh, bass here, bass here. God, I say it always both ways because I don't know which one's right. I'm gonna go with bass because I think you're a fishing guy. Bass here for five U.S. dollars. This is what it looks like when your presuppositional statements BS blow the fuck up on you. Good. Yeah, you're right. Crazy Italian, two dollars. Nice glasses. Does your grandma know they're missing, Chili? That's a good point. You gonna call your grandma and threaten her and tell her to make a, a public statement for you saying she gave you the glasses? She loaned them to you and you took them across state lines? You gonna make her admit that she didn't steal your grandma's glasses? I don't know. It might not be his grandma's. Could be his, his uh, mother, aunts. They're the same people. Uh, the, the bio explorer for five U.S. dollars. Uh, looking forward to court cases. I teach science and push students daily to be skeptics. Thank you. They tend to believe anything on the. I know it's so bad. It's so bad. Um, and the information, just as much misinformation that's out there, there is just as much real information. You just have to look harder for it. 
Uh, Jeff, it's a, it's a shame. Jeff Sanders, twenty dollars. Much love from Chattanooga, Tennessee. Oh man, Jeff. Look, man, I got a good. I, I found a good court case, a good court in Tennessee, and I got a uh, an internet psychic that I want to take and show all to my 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 southern friends, Tennessee, Georgia, because he was going to run to Georgia. They didn't let him. They kept him in jail because he did some dumb shit. All right. Chilby Peach, US $10. It's a thing. You can dislike each other, but when something that affects you both arrives, differences get set aside. Exactly. Some old dude, $10. Hey, skeptic. Hey, chili. The brain does not sense pain. I know, right? He's talking about, ah, oh, it hurts all the way in here. That's your skull, you stupid shit. Cat for $13.99 for Canadian dollars. No message. Thank you very much, cat. Appreciate you. Uh, Mad Max of Spokane, two U.S. dollars. Thank you very much. No message. Appreciate you. Sterlock C for 25 cl claps. Chilean pesos, I believe those are. He's not wearing his headphones to hold his two brain cells together. He's lost one of them. St Streetlock, he lost one of them a long time ago. PhD Tony for five Aussie dollars, my man. PhD Tony. Uh, the fact that he was rambling over a uh, rumen... The fact that he was ruminating over events for 48 days seems a symptom of mental health issues. Whether those be uh, intentional or unintentional, you're probably right. His mental health issues, I mean. Jennifer Case for US $5. Jennifer, thank you so much. Very much so appreciate it. Uh, Forrest Craig. Calm down, Chili. Calm down. Relax. It'll be all right. So he'll find a friend one day. I'm telling you, all he has to do is go out and find, try in his best, try his best to find a patch of grass, right? But when using criteria to find the patch of grass, don't find a patch of grass that you may be able to find a constitutional restriction on. Just go find a random piece of grass in a park where other normal people who don't think about the Constitution daily are and go enjoy life. You'll meet somebody. Now, trust me, you'll meet somebody, Chili. Some old, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, some old dude, USD, $5. Does Chili e-stalk people who are friendly in the in his chat when they go to other chats? I think he, I think what he does is he hate watches. And when he hate watches, he can see his name rolling over. <coughs> Stewie! Stuart Christmas, 29 Sega Genesis dollar. Poor Chili. Poor Chili, victim forever. Exactly, Stewie. Exactly. My man. Love you, brother. Ravenheart, two US dollars. I'm pretty sure he was thinking Shmeen, Shmeer campaign. Uh, he still ain't going to get away with that, Raven. Jerry Gazar for US $10. No message, but I do appreciate it, sir. Uh, let's see. Shay 2, oppositional defiance disorder. I would not, I would definitely not see him being, see, I would not be surprised if a real doctor diagnosed him with something like that. Uh, Serenity Salvador for five U.S. dollars. Thank you very much. Trade wins 1964. Uh, five U.S. dollars. Don't listen to him, Chipple. When when that mean alpha girl gets after you, run like a beta. Beta bouncy baby. Yeah, he did. He said he ran a lot. I think the final number was somewhere around a thousand times he said he would run in the future. Hey, the adults are talking. For five dollars says, don't you feel for him, skeptic? Don't I do. I do, man. God, I wish the sad music was more readily available. I'd play some right now just to show you how sad I am for Chili. Jane's Blonde 007. Uh for USD, two dollars. Uh, his next victim is Floyd for the black vote. Oh, man. Chili will exploit anybody, that's for sure. Phoenix Fist of Fury for $5. Team, don't worry. Okay, sorry. My downloader notified me of a new download. Just making sure it wasn't Chili. Um, Phoenix Fist of Fury, $5. US dollars. Team, don't worry about pausing the video. Blue Bacon is way worse at pausing the video. You are good. Go sub to Blue Bacon if you're not already there. Uh, Shay number two for five USD. He is a snake oil salesman. Absolutely. And he's a grifter. You hear him. He's already trying to lighten his, the blow he already dealt to people who were sovereign citizens. He's trying now to lighten that previous blow. Now, maybe I gave them a little bit too hard of a, 
he's a sovereign citizen, guys. He he will be a sovereign citizen. He will come out speaking. He'll be an American state national, okay? He will constantly find a parallel to being a sovereign citizen. It's, it's like, you know, you have sovereign citizen, American state national, in the middle, Chile. That's where he'll be. He'll be right there where he doesn't have to say he's a sovereign citizen, doesn't have to say he doesn't want to be a citizen of the United States, but will absolutely bitch about everything that citizens are expected to do as citizens. Paul Barry, for $2, is that eyeshadow on me or him? <laughs> Bass here for five US dollars and a sticker. Thank you very much. Uh, Bridge the Divide, JL Warren, USD, $5. What's funny is that his supporters are literally paying his legal fees yes paying money into a system they don't support exactly and they don't get this why jl why don't they get it go sub to bridges the divide paul barry for two dollars i have real friends i blackmailed to being my friends there's some accusations that he's engaging in some blackmailish behavior me i haven't seen any i'm not going to make any assumptions other people are making the assumptions i'm merely reporting on their assumptions i personally don't think he's blackmailing anybody because i think once he starts speaking um people can sense his you know his fucking stupidity but who knows maybe there's somebody out there dumb enough that'll let him blackmail him paul barry for two dollars oh yeah i just read that one trade wins for five us dollars he needs to put the visor or put back on the visor and go back into the matrix no shit samuel green keep doing what you do baby thank you for five dollars, thank you so much, Samuel. I appreciate it. Um, I hate smartphones for five dollars. Thank you, because he is not right in the head and doesn't think things through before he says or does anything. Pat's cat, Chili's video doesn't show it easy either for two dollars, right? Right? Like it would be that easy, Chili. You went to court. Josh's video didn't show it because he conveniently edited it out, as per your word. Kate's video doesn't show it because you conven she conveniently edited it out as per your word. Your video doesn't show it. Why? We'll wait, Chili. We'll wait. In fact, I'll continue reading Super Chats. I know you or one of your followers are here. You've got probably five minutes left of me reading Super Chats and Kate's live stream to post the part of the video where you were knocked over, where she fell on top of you, please post it. Post it. I'll take back what I said tonight. I'll take it all back. All you got to do is show it. I don't have to worry about it, of course. You know that, right? Chat, you know that? I don't have to worry about ever retracting this statement. Okay. Just making sure y'all know that. Uh, let's see. Trade win, 1964, $5. Where's my tear? Tear lasso. Snatch it on, dude. Snatch it on out, dude. Oh, man. He was crying his ass up. He was trying to hold it back, though. He said it a few times. I'm holding it back. And I guess I skipped past the part where he talked about his girlfriend. Now, oh, I won't miss that part. And I'm going to leave that part. I'm not even going to say what I'm going to say because it's really funny. But I'll leave that part for the video that I cover on this. Because I left a lot of meat on the bones. All right? Just so y'all know. I intentionally did that. I didn't stop it. I didn't even pick some of the best parts that I could have criticized him for because that's a video in itself. This was just live off the dome. All right, sorry. Let's go. The Atheist Boy, the Atheist Brony for 10 US dollars. Thank you. How the fuck do you run for governor in, multi in multiple states? I know, right? I know. Aren't you required to live in this state? Yes, yes. But he did say verbatim, this is not, this is not me um, trying to make something of what he said verbatim. This is what he said. I will be the governor of California, um, Alaska, Arizona, or Ohio. One of them will eventually be true. So he intends on running for government or for governor in all those states and someone else brought up to me i've never heard him say it, but they brought up to me and said oh yeah he also said new york as well yeah we'll see um new york or nate nate the lawyer for governor of new york how about that i'll vote for nate before i vote for you chili all right let's go i can't even vote in new york 
Batman works alone. Where's your belt, son? Says Trade Winds 1964. Excuse me, for $5. Uh, thank you very much. And yeah, he doesn't have a belt because he ain't Batman. He's the goddamn Joker. He's the Joker's copy of a copy of a copy. He's a defective Joker. Makes me laugh, though. Krabby J, $5. Because you remind me how pleasant it is to see chilies soaked in boiling water, spinning and churning in a food processor. Good shit. Thank you, Krabby J. I appreciate it. Robin, Robin Johnson. Uh, for 26, yeah, baby. An additional torture stream would help raise money. Um, oh, yeah, no, I, yeah, yeah. The torture streams are last Sunday of every month. All right, the Fridays, I know we did chili tonight, but the Fridays are going to be case review Friday, and it's going to come on later at night. I don't want to stream over other people like Law Talk with Mike. He does really great case review. And I would, I, there's so much out there that he and I can both cover those. But I want to give it to you guys because I know y'all like that. So I want to give you guys an opportunity to see everybody else first. And then we'll do mine like a late night stream. You know what I mean? And we'll go over just some interesting cases I found throughout the day. But I really want to see you guys there. It's going to be completely interactive. You can kind of see the Streamlabs bot going. There was a vote going. I don't know how to work Streamlabs bot that well, but it says there was a poll up that said, do you think Chili will cry tonight? All you got to do is put exclamation point vote and either yes, no, or alpha for alphas don't cry. All right, I'll keep going. Y'all can vote on that if you want. Uh, Ravenheart, $2. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I'll get to you in a second. Uh... Frank Perry for $5. He is super fast. His mommy brought him new sneakers. They make him fast. And he's a little runaway. And Kate would big sl bitch slap him. Sure fucking would. I, I like Kate. Kate's all right in my book, guys. All right? Kate's all right in my book. Uh, I hate smartphones for $2. He did run. That is true. He ran right to the police. I hate smartphones. Good job. Raven art two dollars for an alpha. He sure bitches a lot. Yeah, I know, right? Sure lets everybody else determine his life. Jennifer Keys, US ten dollars. You are amazing. I enjoy every time I see you drop a video, Team Skeptic. Thank you very much. I work really hard, but I love what I do. You guys make it really fun and enjoyable too. Don't ever not credit yourself uh, in the chat right now uh, because I love it. I love it. I, lo I go back. I read the live chat. Because I can't catch everything, but I do read the live chat after my videos, and it's really badass. All right, here we go. Uh, Gia, for $20, I'll take the narcissist getting pile of horse poo for 500 Alex. Uh, yes, and you'd be correct there, Gia. Pat's Cats, for $2. I like consequences. I do, too. Oh, I think, hold on. Ah, we're done. We're done. All right, good deal. We're done. All right, so now let me go over here. There's a couple more that came in. Let me, I know. Oh, Miss Schrodinger's cat. $5. Great Southern accent. Much love. It's not really fucking hard for me to talk country. It's, I, I have to make a conscious effort not to because if I get around my family too long, like not all my family, my family's pretty, you know, we're pretty, pretty city boy. But um, if we go out and do something like go out with my extended family and we go out to like the lake or the country or anything like that, I come back sounding like a goddamn hillbilly, like I fuck, need a fucking piece of straw in my mouth or something. It's just that is my more natural. This right here is just me really trying to be uh, like understandable and, and, you know, just try to be articulate, you know. Uh, I know that I devolve sometimes in my articulisms. But I, I apologize for that. N A N A for six six is six, my man. <laughs> Love you, Miss Schrodinger's cat. Love you, N A N A. Mister Pajato for five Aussie dollars. I'm lover, not a fighter. No, I'm a fighter, not a lover. No, no, no. What am I? Sad and hurt. Yeah, he did say that, didn't he? He's like, oh man, I would never hit a woman. I'm not like that. And he turns around. He's like, but I'm a fighter. Remember in this video, I'm in self defense, defense mode, lady. I'm gonna get you, lady. Get that lady away from me. Oh my God, it was so beautiful. Thank you, Chili, for being an internet bully and getting called out in real life. Mark Schmidt, Mark Swint, 199. Need to do more of these live chats. Great job. Thank you, Mark. I appreciate it. Uh, Mystery Man for 981. We're almost done. It's the law. Gravity wins. <laughs> for, thank you so much. Jill Wagner for $5. He threatened Josh. What? 
When did he threaten Josh? I'm not a big fan of Josh's, but what Chili did to him after all this is really messed up. Watch Josh's live stream. Okay, Jill, I will do that. But not before I go and watch Kate from the Masshole Report. So again, there's always people I want to give a shout out to at the end of these streams so that you guys can know who I support and who I think you should go uh, sub to. Brainy Beaver's in the chat right now. The Plot Hole's in the chat. J.L. Warren, he's in the chat. The Mass Hole's about to go live right now. Go sub to her. Old Squish Squishy Gardener. Tones Over Thinks it's out there. Hezekiah's out there. Unclean Hands is out there. All these people are out there right now. If you're a if you're a, 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 a channel, okay, leave your chat. Most I, I, I mod most channels. I, I don't know if Lackluster's still here. I would have given him a mod if I'd have seen it more, um, more in the moment. Uh, because I don't like when other big channels are around and they can be timed out by somebody or even have what they want to say being held back. One thing I know about Lackluster, I've watched a lot of his videos. He's fair to the, for the most part. We probably still disagree on a lot of things, but I, but that's somebody I can I, I feel like I could have a conversation with about our disagreements because ultimately he and I both want the same thing. We, we prefer preservation of freedom of speech. We'd like to see prison reform. And I personally would love to see some police training reform. Okay, we, we got to have that, guys. Uh, I'm not a police basher. Everybody knows I'm go police, pro police, thin blue line. Yo, Team Skeptic's all about it. Okay, I know how hard that job is and how stressful it can be. And I know the weight that these guys take home to their families and they come back the next day and do it again. So I appreciate that and I'm not going to knock them. But we got to have... We gotta ha figure out how to make police, you know, operate better within the construct, the social constructs that exist already, and it's not working the way it is, in my opinion. It could be better. And I'm not saying it's not working. I'm just saying it could be better. So he and I could probably both agree on a lot of those things, and we'd probably still find reasons to disagree as well. Um, so lackluster, if you're still out there, thank you for stopping by. Uh, Everybody out there, if you're looking for an auditor channel that where you would see a more, I would say a, a little bit more of a non-biased view. It's not always non-biased. Like me, I'm not always non-biased either. I'm not saying, oh, I'm so much better than him. No, just it's more non-biased than you'll get from Detroit Metro Audits, Long Island Audits, or any of these, these other guys that tend to stick the most uh, controversial audits up so that they can gain viewers, subscribers, and clicks and whatnot. So uh, thank you, Lackluster, for stopping by, and you guys have a good night. Uh, does anybody have anything they want to say? Y'all want to do, what are you, are you filling court, uh, Friday night court case review? Or Friday night case review, that's what it's going to be called, Friday night case review, probably 8, 9 o'clock at night. All right, let's, let me get the chat, let me get the, uh, let me get Kate's, Kate's video up in the chat, because we need to send people there. Oh, man, we really need to talk about what's going on. She starts in three minutes. We will go live. We'll stay live. I'll take any any chats right now, um, and I'll try to respond to them for you guys real quick. Uh, if you guys would please continue to share that link, moderators. Uh, shout out to Bridge the Divide. Yes, shout out to Bridge the Divide. Love that guy. 100% warrior mentality needs to be reconsidered. There's a an argument for that. There's an argument for that. Uh, yeah, Doctor Who Designs, exactly, two minutes. We're going to two-minute bullshit you guys, and then I'm going to send you over there. Daryl M., I miss you. Miss you, brother. Plot Holes Live too. Ah, that sucks. Well, I'll let you guys decide who you're going to go watch because they're both equally good in my book. Uh, you can go watch the plot hole if you'd like to go watch the plot hole, or you can head over and watch Mass Hole Reports if you'd like to watch Mass Hole. Congrats on all the views. Thank you, Uncle Arties. Hey, I noticed that your moderator was gone. I accidentally deleted a few moderators. The final nail was one of them as well. I do apologize. I fixed the problem. If you happen to lose your moderator, it, it totally on me and accidentally, uh, just let me know in the chat. I'll remember if I deleted you or not. Frank Padilla for a dollar. Thank you very much, my friend. Miss Schrodinger's cat, I just want to say, I love you. You're, you're like a big sister to me and will always be. Long live Schrodinger's cat every single time. Long live Schrodinger's cat. All right, guys. You guys ready? Who here is ready to go see what Kate's talking about? In Because, hey, I'm telling you, 
She was in court. I'm giving it. I'm giving you my perspective on it. She was there. She was there. Go check her out. Love you guys. Legicator. Legicator in the chat. Love you, man. You're amazing. Thank you so much for being the person you are and, and stepping up. I'm telling you, man, I know you guys go through some fucking stressful shit in your life and you come back here all the time. Thank you. Thank you from the bottom of my heart, Legicator. All right? Thank you. All right, guys. I'm out of here. I'm Team Skeptic. Oh, let me fix the chair. Let me fix the chair. Oh. One in the chat if you think I'm going to fail. Everybody go check out one of those two live streams. One in the chat if you think I'm going to fail. Let's see. No ones. No ones. I don't see any ones. Nobody thinks I'm going to fail. I love you guys. June King, $5. It's my birthday today. Why did you super chat me? Happy birthday. Don't super chat me next time. Oh, look at all the ones. NANA is ruining it for everybody. Guys, I'm Team Skeptic. This was fun. Oh, shit. I always fuck up that part. That's not considered a fail because the fail part is the fallback part. All right. I'm Team Skeptic. And I'm out.